Bum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. Happy Thursday! Welcome back, ladies and gents. All right, we return again to the fixed camera mod for Resident Evil 2 Remake. Uh, we finished Claire A yesterday, and it was an incredible experience. The mod works so well, and it got another update today. It got another update today to further refine things, so we'll see how how that all uh, works out. Today we'll be doing Leon Second, or Leon B, and I really like playing the... I like playing the uh, second scenario a lot, because it's a lot more difficult than the first. If you saw the last stream, we were literally swimming in acid rounds last time, and I was playing on hardcore too, so the B scenario, the second scenario, at least at the start, is like a lot harder, so it's a lot more in engaging. Um, so yeah. Hello, cartographer, gullible, and primus. Swimming in acid. I'm drinking acid rounds right now. Now I see why um they didn't do any damage against Birkin 4. It's not killing me, but it does taste good. Okay, so let's see what the uh let's see what in other options the today's update gave us. I think they rebalanced some of the um some of the uh auto aiming. Rewrote some stuff to refine th some things. Let's see. Allow twist. Twist roll while following. Oh, that's a new option. Hey, Connor. Yeah, I would have loved that too, Connor. And again, we're playing with a whole bunch of classic mods that... Uh, Predominantly affect the character designs, but we have a whole bunch of stuff like all the classic weapon sounds have been remixed into the game We have classic UI We got uh, a couple of music changes like the stars office to reflect what it actually is uh, in the original We are not playing re3 remake today Oh, they also got a no vignette option. I like how literally every like mod package for Resident Evil 2 Remake comes with its own vignette disable disabling option because <laughs> everybody hates the vignette. <laughs> I do. That's for sure. I think I will slightly increase the camera strength for the on the player character because this mod has a lot of wide camera shots. So, like the Raccoon City streets, and it can be hard to see. Let's see. wonder if I can disable this and it'll still let me have my usual controls. I didn't use the D-pad for tank controls last time, um, but I had that enabled because, in, at least in a previous version of the mod, I needed that enabled for the full functionality of the tank controls. All right, let's see. I'm going to uh, rebind the disable auto aim thing. So I don't accidentally end up doing that all the time. Cuz I feel like I did that a couple of times last time and I was wondering why <laughs> why my what happened to my auto aim? All right. I'll probably run around in the RPD courtyard for a, a minute to see what kind of adjustments have been made to the mod. It was already really polished uh, last time, so I can't wait to see like what this mod is gonna look like in like a month or something. Hello again, five star. Oh, yeah, I'm curious how RE3 Remake would play, but to be honest, I'm not, I, I don't have the interest to play RE3 Remake in general. All right, Leon, I, I wish, I, I wanna be able to load up save I just did that comp completed as Claire and loaded up as Leon. It feels wrong. It feels so wrong to complete Claire A, but then have to do a new game as Leon. It's just like, it's just that reminder that nothing I did in Claire A will have any impact on 
Leon B. It's just like, ugh. Anyway, new game. Leon B. Do not be fooled by the uh, horrendous fashion sense shown on our hero. So actually, Leon's Leon's jacket and his uh Leon's Leon's drip by default isn't that bad. His uh his civilian clothes. But uh other than that, just uh, avert your eyes. Avert your eyes while we uh power through this. Everybody looking, you know, slightly different. Like they're looking like live live action cast actors versions of themselves. Just bear no mind to that. We'll get to see this scene though. And uh, don't question where Leon gets his RPD uniform either. Don't question the butt chin, just uh, vibe with it for now. No one's around. God, Leon in this game is like the crimson chin. Last time on The Walking Dead. Get down. Who the Who the frick's that lady? Discount player. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. <laughs> They're like huh? the characters in this game look like Netflix adaptation versions yeah. of themselves. Right that now. that like that meme. <sighs> not the not the literal. Netflix adaptation. I don't even know if that was Netflix. You know what I mean. I was- I am still so disappointed we don't get to run through the streets at all in the B scenario. We just teleport the, to the RPD. Alright, back to the real Resident Evil 2. Alright, so Leon is running two- three mods here. One that slightly darkens the tint on his RPD uniform. That is a good camera angle right there with the clock tower and everything. Love it. This mod's already... Oh, this camera angle showing the graves. This mod's already off to a great start in the B scenario. Leon is running uh, three mods here. He is running the um, a mod that slightly darkens the tints on his RPD uniform because it was like really saturated in uh, stock. Which also adds the utility belt from his uh, default costume onto his waist. And then he's got a mod that makes his face a little bit more like RE4, so it de butt chinifies him and gets sort of all the weird moles on his face. <laughs> um, and have a mod that darkens his hair to match the original game's uh, hair tint for him as well. Alright. So let's see. I think uh, most of the. Uh, any changes are gonna be really subtle, like uh, how the auto aiming works. And probably some uh, fixes to various things like uh, the walking, stuff like that. It's probably not going to be something too obvious, but uh, I'm sure the experience is going to be even better than it was yesterday. I'm still wondering, debating if I should turn on the crosshair, because that's actually like really... I'm going to play with the crosshair. I actually didn't play with the crosshair enabled last time because for immersion's sake, but I want to see how the game plays with it. It'll obviously like let me... Uh, it'll make it a lot easier to know if, when I'm aiming at something off-screen, so I'll enable that. But I'll leave the laser sight invisible. Still don't have the, uh, tr the RE2 Remake Trainer enabled that makes the characters, like, a lot less moist. <laughs> Leon's looking good, if a little moist. God, the the, the the wetness from the rain does not play well with the, this game's horrible aliasing, at least from this distance. Getting the N64 version of RE2? Interesting. You only have five bullets in your gun, Leon. Okay, we're gonna have an easier early game than Claire, but it's balanced out by the B scenario being generally harder. There's a flash grenade somewhere around here. Should I increase the speed at which the, they turn? That feels on par with OG. 
Wait, what is my what is my running turning speed? My turn speed when running is higher than walking, but it feels like Okay. Well it feels fine anyway. I don't know why my the game isn't hiding my mouse curse. Get out of here! Get out of here. You're doing your own Resident Evil 2 remake? That is ambitious. Where's the flash grenade that's over here? I might need that. Is there a flash grenade here? There's a red herb. Am I crazy? Am I misremembering that there's actually a flash over here? Is there a flash or am I misremembering that? The B scenario here definitely like throws you into the deep end and I love it. How Ada looks at the mods? Oh yeah, I'm really happy with how I've uh, made her look. Or how modders have made her look and I have installed and combined those mods. Hey. There she is. <laughs> Leon, I'll be right there. Wait, you don't have one of the key, a key in those fancy pockets? Leon, we really gotta stop meeting like this. Are you all right? Police chopper it just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. They're so 90s, I love it. No, we don't. It's good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah. Did you find your brother? I did, actually. He's... Sipping a pina colada on a beach somewhere. Just when you think it can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. You've alerted the horde. Just get yourself to see. God, I can't wait to stop being soaking wet. It makes the characters look so dumb. I, I think it would look better if the game didn't have if the game had better native anti-aliasing. But it just makes everything shimmer so brightly. God. Hey, that's not cool. All right, I'm not accepting that. <laughs> We're doing that again. This is already really tough in the game in the normal game to get through here without taking a hit. Doesn't help that the camera angle there like obscures where I'm facing and it has a zombie right in front of me. What do I even do there? I need to like turn immediately to the right and book it. Where's the other herb? Oh yeah, let me test out disabling the D-pad and controls. That'll let me use the weapon shortcuts, but... Will that take away any functionality from uh, my regular controls? Uh, this mod has like this mod has an issue where you're still able to turn a bunch of times after hitting a quick turn and it can get really disorienting I don't know I don't know why I'm still able to pivot like this when I have the I have the true tank controls turned on tank controls no run backward what is this option let me do I actually have to hold B to run with that, like the originals.
I should not be able to do this. <laughs> I'm spinning my control stick right now. That causes lots of problems. Whoa! The fuck? Ian's a interloper. What is actually the difference with this? Uh, what the frick? I'm gonna turn those off. What if I disable running quick turn? Will I just... Can I just, uh... Turn around normally if I do that? No, that breaks the quick turn if, you, if I do it like that. Get this weirdness. And he won't stop running. Why does Leon keep teleporting? <laughs> stop it. What if I were to remap the running quick turn button to X? Nah, then the the quick I have two different quick turnings between walking and running. That's that wouldn't be good. I tried using classic game before, but it's like very strange. You like move around while you're using it and it's like feels very unnatural. Yeah, Leon's just like pivoting all over the place for some reason with this option. Instead of standing in place when I use the other stick, so I'll not have classic aim. I'll just keep the ability to turn left and right. Okay, are my controls back to what they should be? I turned off D-pad tank controls. I don't know. I think uh, I think turning that off allowed uh, keeps all my other functionality just fine. Strafe classic game. Classic aim. What? That's on a hotkey that I might accidentally press. Yeah, let's not. Let's remap that to something I won't accidentally press a million times. The thing to turn the camera. Get these off of my freaking things. Because I'm going to press one of these and it's going to ruin everything in the middle of combat and I'm going to wonder why my controls aren't working anymore. So let's turn camera. What? Why does Leon keep doing that? Alright, just uh, get rid of all of that. Alright, we should be Gucci. They run in slow-mo in this mod? Well, that's because they the running animation doesn't match the actual speed. They uh, traverse in like this with the stock animation. Here it does. Like they look like they're they're like running on ice with the default running animation. Okay, let's see if this goes better. Yeah, make a hard right. Whoa, wait, wait. Was I moving before it faded back in? I was like way further. I was like in a different. I was in a different country compared to where it was before. Uh, how am I gonna get past this bitch? I don't even I don't even remember how to get through this without taking damage in the regular game. Is there not a flash grenade here? I swear I remember there being a flash grenade. Maybe that's only on standard. Maybe they were 
Maybe they, they replaced the flashbang with an ink ribbon. But yeah, I, it is really, really bad for me to take a hit in the early game here on Hardcore, because the early game in the beat scenario is no joke. And I don't want to use this stuff either, because I want to save, save that. Oh, his running animation changed because he thinks the ledge there is a uh, stair. Stairs. Oh, fuck off, God. Yeah, you can move a bit before before it fades in. Interesting. Oh my God, why does Leon keep teleporting? <laughs> this didn't happen at all in the last stream. But we'll get an RE3 remake, director's cut. We're more, I think we're more likely to get another remake of RE3 remake in general than we are to get a director's cut of the existing game. And I think that'd be for the better. RE3 remake does not provide a like a good base for a good remake as it is. I don't know how to get past the other zombie, though. Uh, the zombie that's, a uh... What? Why? Uh, Leon's teleporting! Stop it. This is a glitch introduced with this update. Whoa, baby. Come on. There you go. Got her. She was, like... Camping there before that's why I had trouble getting faster. There we go. Still can't save though. So we're still We're not out of the woods yet All right now we get to play with the uh... Now fuck that shit Leon you already got drip Now we get to play with the uh, the gangsta gun. I forget what it's called. Yeah, just, exactly how I just pretend you put uh, some police clothes over your police clothes. Hey, Brad! It's like the poster is like Capcom's sorry message that he's not in this game. Alright, how do we want to go about this? I need to use up the ammo that I have in this gun and then switch over to this. Still don't want to take a hit. And then, why does it give me an ink ribbon? Like, right at the start if there's not actually a typewriter in here. Because we're going to go into the break room anyway, and I think it's going to give us an ink ribbon in there. I feel like they placed that ink ribbon there with the misconception that they're that the other some other dev put an ink ribbon, put a typewriter in here, but they never did. <laughs> Do, do, do. Okay, um, I know this handgun is more powerful. Oh yeah, it's a, it's a M1911. Yeah, that's a gun right there, baby. That's a well modeled gun. Then I got this space laser here. <laughs> I like the VP70. It's like, it's a very nostalgic gun. You need to clean your gun, Leon. God damn, like it's so dirty. Did you put this in the toilet? I do have the classic UI mod and I have the realistic weapons name mod. I also have the dynamic weapon, dynamic uh, weapon uh, icons as well. So they're not just like, I don't know, they're not just flat facing to the right. They're more dynamic like they were in the original game. Actually, wait, were they like that in the original game? I might be thinking of RE1 remake. I think in RE2 original, they were all, they were all uh, facing to the right. Or left. Or left. Don't, don't talk while you're trying to drink something. It's got an eagle on it. Raccoon police. Okay. How do I want to approach taking this guy out? I feel like I want to run around this guy. 
But I gotta wait for him to like pass through beside me. It's a battle! I'm not killing any of these fuckers. So I never have to come back out here. Oh god, this the cat the fixed camera makes us ah! makes us even more tense. Wait, that guy was facing the other way. Whoa! Nope, 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 nope. Taking a hit here is really, really bad, so I don't want to deal with that. I, I should have gone forward there, because the the guy had his back turned to me. I wonder if the modder will include an option at some point to disable or tone down the the crazy double lunge that zombies have in this game. I wouldn't be against that. But I feel like I feel like the difficulty with this mod is like is 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 like uh, already really balanced. So be wary against any balance changes to the enemies because I feel like uh, the auto aim, any like, any more difficulty introduced with the more limited movement to make this uh, feel good is made up for by much more aggressive auto aim. So that balance is out there. So I feel like any any further adjustments to the enemies balancing might be a little too much. Oh god, this lady's gonna ruin me. What? I I teleported again. What is going on? Oh my god. What the fu- ah! Someone help, I'm scared. Is this gonna keep happening? I wonder if it's a glitch introduced in this update. If I was playing as Claire, I could just like take that uh, herb combo and then I would be in caution so I'd be faster. But uh, Leon, I don't think he has that luxury. The problem with getting away from this guy really fast is that this lady over here becomes a problem. I can tell speed runs of the second scenario are really fun with the zombie pathfinding RNG. Door? Not exactly how I picture breaking this in. I'll break you in. Break you in if you don't stop teleporting. I could use the grenade here, but there are much better things to use this grenade on than zombies that I'll never have to see again. Alright, where's this other dude? There you are. Might have to shoot their legs to run past, but uh, that's worth it. Good god, man. The lunges in this game give me nightmares. Alright, we made it. I need to go and save ASAP. Wait, can zombies break through this? Not how I imagined my first day. Okay, uh, what's the... I need to go through here to get to the safe room, right? Safe room. Are you just gonna break that immediately? Cool. Wait, should I save this for one of the boards that's in the, the break room hallway? Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. God. I need to kill this guy. Or at least take out his legs. So you can't follow me through this door. See, so I have the reticle enabled now, so I can actually see we uh 
see where I'm aiming. Oh, come on, dude. Can I get some fucking good RNG, please? Wait, is he stuck out there now? I don't want to go through that bullshit again. All right, there's a fuck ton of guys in here that all need to die. Or there will be a fuck ton of guys in here eventually. I know I need to board up at least two of these windows. Chuck an ammo in there, just like an OG. Oh my god, can you stop? That is so disorienting. Is there even a healing item in here? There's just a bunch of fucking blue herbs. Alright, we gotta clear out some dudes now. Gotta choose who we fight very carefully, because we do not have very many resources to spare. Know the release date of H2R? Nope. It's over 70% done, though. Oh, there's another teleport. Hey, Isaac, thank you for the two bucks. Thoughts on Emerald from Sonic Battle? I've never played Sonic Battle. How do you even... How does that glitch even happen, I wonder? It's like the game getting confused on my... my world coordinates or something. Alright, I'll save. Actually, no, fuck that. If I die, I die. And I'll uh, try to... get in a better position. I think I should have saved the boards for one of these windows, but I don't remember which. This dude here is probably still alive. Yep. I teleported again. What are you made of, David? Oh wait, this is Elliot, isn't it? Is that dude still outside this other door? Cause like, I feel like he's not supposed to be able to come out here. Yeah, he just, he didn't even get back up. He just gave up. <laughs> okay. I like, he grabbed me and then I threw him into a, a, a zone he's not supposed to be in. Is it, uh, the first aid spray is still in here. Nope, don't discard that. I hate my controller. I love my controller, but it's like this stick has some drift. Leon! There goes the no heal run yet. I already failed the no hit run. Might as well fail the no heal run while I'm at it. Alright, I gotta kill everybody in the main hall. This is my most important task. There we go, more boards. I still don't know which windows I need to board up, though. It'll probably be a zombie that comes and bangs on one of them that'll let me know. I know there's zombies in that office there, but I really need to focus on killing the guys in here first. Otherwise, they're going to make the entire rest of the game a living hell, especially with early Mr. X. My man, Marvin. You're not Marvin. Hello? Is anybody here? Me on multitasking, checking for survivors while knifing a zombie.
There's some mean of them to remove the item box from here as well. Uh, let's not touch that. Does Mr. X not trigger? Does Mr. X not trigger until you get to the uh, star's office hallway? If you don't look on the the camera, Leon glowing in the dark. Yeah, that's all I can see him. <laughs> uh oh. What in the? <laughs> I still love that they moved the liquor back to its original spot in the second scenario. Stroke of genius. There are two more zombies in here, including Marvin. Marvin Martian. I, don't, I can't see him, though. See this lady. Targeting reticle is coming in a lot handier. Here. It's a lot easier to see than this, just the dot. I can't. I'm having trouble sh aiming at this lady's head, though. Hold on. Can I increase the aiming allowance? Oh, that work. Increase that to all the way up. Let's see what that allows me to do. I feel like that might cause more problems than it. It might hurt more than it helps. Thank you for the five bucks, Isaac. When you ever do your SA2 Dream Remake video and possibly make 100% emblem completion for characters. Who would you replace Shadow Rouge and Eggman with? Oh, you mean they're unlockable characters? I don't know. I haven't given any thought to that. They have to abide by the abide and fit by with their gameplay styles. Do I have the every weapon has laser sight enabled? Yeah, I do. All right, Marvin, get over here. Oh, I didn't realize the reticle focus thing was still uh, enabled with the uh, laser sight option. You are definitely not dead, so let's fix that. Mouse, get off the screen! Oh no. Well, I got good use out of it anyway. I think that's everybody in the main hall. Those are my main concerns for these guys. Oh, can you stop it, Leon? <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, my knife broke because I got grabbed by the zombie. Um, what uh, can I... Which ones can I solve with this? Scrap of paper. I can't see the lion with this. See the unicorn, though. How do you solve the lion one with this? Oh, I think it, there's a there's a photo that you have to develop to uh, see the solution to that. Why was he not quick in quick turning there? I wish they changed these combinations on the B scenario. I really like what they did with the, the the handguns in the B scenario. That was a really clever way of shaking things up and also implementing those weapons from the original game. 
this remake does have its uh quite a few of its genius moments amidst uh, some disappointments Okay, what else do I need to do? I need to get the stuff that's in the east office. Is there anything else in here? I think I got everything. I should go and save though. Maybe use these boards if there's a zombie that appears. Ah! <laughs> Every time that happens, it hurts. It hurts me viscerally. Alright, anybody want to play in this hall? I still don't know which windows I need to board up. Given that the camera is focused on that one, I'm thinking maybe this one. But I don't want to do that and then regret it later. Just put this away for now. He really needs to disable like the the quick turning when hitting the control stick on this control scheme because it throws me off every time. Is that because I let me re-enable that and see if that fixes it? What does this attachment do? Reduces recoil, I think. Maybe closes the reticle more. Did I... I didn't cut those bolts yet. Nope, I'm still able to do... I should not be able to do this with the tank controls on. It just conflicts with the... everything else. I'm playing on hardcore, yeah. Only hardcore has the ink ribbons. I wonder when does the zombie when did the zombies trigger to hit the windows here? I hope they give me a warning so I know which one to board up and don't just break through immediately. I hope they don't make me have to guess which one I have to board up. Look at them spicy bolt cutters. Hello? Oh, I need to board this up. Actually, wait. I can just shoot that zombie's legs when he comes through so he can't get out of here. So I'll, I won't waste a board on that window. Same with you. I'm just going to break your legs. Leon? There we go. Just need to break these two zombies' legs and I never need to come back in here. What the? What the? Nice. Got good RNG there. I like the targeting reticle, honestly. Okay. There's a flash grenade over there I need to get. Where's the flash? Where's the flash? Okay. Goodbye, East Office. What the surprised face? That's one what the... We're gonna be keeping count. I know, right? They need to actually, like... Put those games in a collection, like it's free money.
What else? Uh, I need to go through the hallway of hell. <laughs> oh god. Uh, is I don't think Mr. X is gonna be in there. Um. Oh wait, I can't do. Th I need to. I'm gonna be sitting on the bolt cutters for a while. Wait. No, I need to go through the hallway of hell. There's a liquor. Right, there's the liquor in there. Okay, so I'm gonna use up the bolt cutters there. So I might need to save again, but uh, to be honest, I don't want to. All I really did was just knock out a couple zombie legs. I think I... I don't think... Maybe I need to... I'll bring the wooden boards. I don't know if there are any zombies that come into that hallway with the liquor. Or if I can board them up preemptive, preemptively. But that hallway is going to be a nightmare coming back in when I have the, the club key. With the liquors, zombies, and Mr. X. Woof! Okay. Okay, just never go into that office, just go around the whole, uh, from now on. That saved me quite a bit of bullets that I'll need. Is there anywhere else I'm able to go from here? I think everywhere else is blocked off by the, uh, spade key door, so I can only go through here. I only need to go to the far end of this hallway once, so I think I should board up the window that's by the club key door. That one's already boarded up. All these are already boarded up, actually. Where, where did the zombies in this hallway come from, then, when I next come in? Wait, is there a window anywhere I can board up in here? Oh no, let's not go that way. Why are all the windows boarded up already? Because I know there are zombies that come into here later. Do they just not let me board any of them up so they can break them all later? What a dick move. It might be like that originally. I don't remember. There's gonna be a liquor in here. Where's the body that's usually here? It's supposed to be a zombie body there. Maybe it doesn't show up in the second scenario. Okay, that guy is not, there's no zombie asleep there. Let me get to the, uh, the save room and I'll save. That guy comes through immediately.
Where are you going? Nice. I think there is another zombie that comes through here eventually, so I should board that up again. Have the boards to spare. Okay. Now I will save. Whoop. That is a lot of ink ribbons that it just gave me. Holy shit. Yeah, they were expecting me to save a lot in the early game here. Alright, let's go round some stuff up. There's a lot of looting to be done in the early game of the second scenario. I know there's a liquor that comes into that hall later. Is there a dude in here yet? Where's the zombie that's in here? Is, uh, is this office clear? Wait, why can't I interact with this? Hello? Hello? Why can't I interact with that? That's where you get a hip pouch. Wait, I can't interact interact with these either. Wait, something fuck something's fucked up. <laughs> something broke. What's going on here? Whoa. There's that, there's that spot that turns into uh, over the shoulder randomly. Oh, wait, all the items despawn. All the shit's like, shit like despawned and I couldn't interact with anything. What the fuck? Oh God, I think the mod's latest update uh, borked some stuff. I always forget what, what order of the numbers this is supposed to go in. Nine, 15, seven. There we go. Oh, wait, who's that? What was that? What was that? Who is that? Wait, what? Wait, where? Oh. Oh, that zombie was supposed to be there, but he wasn't before because objects were despawning, I guess. I need you perchance have a knife on you to slice you with. Oh, he died already. Hello, takedown, by the way. Ned. M R G. I love how I'm getting all these attachments for the gun that I'm not using. Not yet, anyway. I'll use it once I'm out of uh. What would you want to do in the B scenario is you want to use up all the hand use up all the ammo in one of the handguns first, and then switch over to the other one. To use up all the ammo in, in that one and then just keep going back and forth rather than carrying both of them at the same time uh that this guy in here is going to come back to life once uh i open that door but i have more important zombies to kill ned flanders oh yeah this guy's supposed to be here too <laughs> all the objects despawned when i was coming through here I need a knife so I can actually slice these guys. Boop.
Will the board still be there? Yeah, they're still there. Not all the objects despawned, only like the some interactable stuff like the safe and the enemies despawned. That was so bizarre. I don't know if that was from the game or from the mod. But I have been teleporting around a bit, so <laughs> I did not have any of these issues on yesterday's stream. Yo, Jays! Good to see ya. Shutting off all the lights was the best choice. Eh, give or take. I wouldn't want all the areas to be pitch black because the game... Then the game's color palette only becomes like one color the whole time. Hmm. Um... What was this? What was this that I just got? Remember... Ah, that's useless. I need the... Need the film that gives me the combo for the lion statue. Do -do 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 -do. But the fixed camera with the flashlight, though, uh, does lurk work really, really well. As long as the rooms aren't too pitch black, and so you can actually still see stuff without having the, to point the flashlight at it. That being able to point the flashlight in fixed camera perspective does add a lot. It is really nice. We've really missed that much in the third decade of the third decade of the 21st century. Yeah, there's still demand for it. People really like the style, including me. If there wasn't any demand for it, there wouldn't be like over like 5,000 downloads of this mod of, of this mod, which came out only to like two weeks ago. I have so many ink ribbons. <laughs> God. These are some of my fam favorite angles, the staircase. Uh oh, this ammo here. I hope the lady that's supposed to be sitting there didn't despawn. Oh, nice. Wait, what are you doing over here? What woke you up? What the hell? What the hell? Where's my laser sight? Oh, oh fuck you! <laughs> Jesus Christ. They pinned the RE4 HD project on the community page? Well, I guess it just depends on whoever at Capcom is in charge of, like, overseeing that stuff, because part of Cap- someone at Capcom really does not like mods. We got the puzzle thing replaced with the box here. I have the steam valve, but I'm gonna wait to go in there. I know Mr. X is gonna show up when I get into the star's office, so I want to delay going in there as long as possible until I have everything I need. Oh, I love how they actually put a zombie here in the fake out area. They do so many good things in the early game of the B scenario. So many genius things. I just wish there was more, more of it. Why can't I see my laser sight? What the? Oh, there's number two. What the? All right, I'll deal with you in a second. Why does he have a ghetto grip on the pistol? Because that's a callback to the uh, 
to the, how he held a pistol in the original game. It was originally an unlockable weapon, and here they're using it for the beast scenario to shake things up. Okay, I will go and kill this guy. I don't know if I should save, though. I don't know what's in the, um... I don't know what's in the upstairs. There might be a liquor up there. Did this guy die? Where'd he go? Was it you? I think I killed him. He holds his regular pistol normally. From his tank top fit with the OG with the cap. Well, the, the outfit, the costume was an unlockable, wasn't it? Like you had to have the uh, special key to open the locker, didn't you? Yeah, I hope he's dead. He fell three stories. He did a lot of the work for me. My favorite RE game? I, that's a hard question, to be honest. I am like super hardcore into RE4 remake. But uh, other than that, it'd probably be RE1 remake. All right, don't show up yet, Mr. X. Just give me a little bit more time before I trigger you. All right, is there a liquor in there? I love the dust particles in front of the camera. I can board up that entire hallway by the break room if I wanted to. I need to blow that guy's head off when I uh, get the shuck in. Oh, thank you for that shimmer shine. He lives to be triggered. I need the knife that's down here so I can stop wasting ammo. Where's the lady? The lady's on the other side and is in the wrong place again. <laughs> Get over here. Don't make me trigger this guy. Get over here. Lady! Well, uh, if you're gonna do that, let me go get the unicorn medallion over here. I know, right? The modder really knows what he's doing. Okay, that'll let me get the lion statue one. Okay, where is the combination for this? Uh, there's a snake on that one. Okay, so children, scale, and snake. No step on snake. I like how there are two of them. One of them is going re. Lady. There we go, come on. Stop hissing in my ear! There we go. You dead? Nice. You went down easy. I wonder, I should try the invert backing up thing, because that always confused me in the fixed camera games. That was the only part of the controls that never gelled with me. Let me uninvert the turning when backing up and see how I like that. Beep, 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 beep. 
I hope if Capcom ever makes a fixed camera game, they have a bunch of control options like this. This mod shows how... what kinds of things you can do with this type of game. Nearly out of ammo for this. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. I want to hear like several knife slashes in a row. The knife is so good in this game. Why is the knife in RE2 Remake better than the knife in RE4 Remake? It's a shame in RE4 Remake, I don't even use the knife to do damage on enemies anymore. It's purely for parrying. Okay. I think I did... Let me unlock this door. Unlock this door and then unlock the door on the other side as well. Actually, wait. How much stuff can I do before triggering Mr. X, I wonder? Let's test that. Did you get handgun bullets? Uh, not regular handgun bullets, but I have lots of gunpowder. Now let me go unlock the door downstairs so I can get rid of those. On the bench down from library door? Um, I know what you're talking about. I don't- maybe I forgot about that. I think I got them. Yep, I did. I love how freeform the second scenario RPD is compared to the first. It's a lot more engaging. Hey, I forget where I get the weapon key card. in the second scenario. Library's telling me it still has an item in it. Uh, there's, cause there's handgun ammo under the, the bookcase here. Let's see if I can get some stuff over here without even triggering him, or if he's just gonna burst in and ruin my fun. Oh wait, wait, all oh, right, there are zombies in here <laughs> in the second scenario. I need to go get my actual, I might need to go get my handgun. So, because this guy might not go down in six shots. Yeah, there's that guy, and then there's the one of the helicopter pilots, so we got a fire zombie in here as well. Shotgun? I, I don't actually remember where to get the key card. Weapon locker key card in the B scenario. Don't go in there. Did I get the stuff that was in here? I think I did. Alright, anybody gonna say hi to me in here? I got a board if need be. There are four of them, four windows in here, and I don't know which one I need to board up. It's gonna be too late by the time I by the time a zombie appears. It's not gonna give me any warning. I mean I have enough boards, I don't even know what windows are gonna board up after this. It's what windows even are there still that I can board up in the RPD? There's the window by the in the in the hallway where Mr. X burst through the wall, but then you get more wooden boards there anyway, so 
I think I don't I think I don't have any reason not to use these boards here. Let me save again since I have such a surplus of ink ribbons. God, I love the B scenarios RPD. It's actually like challenging. I know there's there's only only two of these windows the zombies come out of, so I'm gonna board this one up because the camera is framing this one. And maybe this one as well. Or this one. Yeah, this one. This one. Okay. I think we should be good. I think those are the only ones I need to board up. The art room? That's where it is in the first and oh I forgot about this guy. <laughs> Oops. Wait, no, no, don't go back in there. No, he's going back into his, into where he's supposed to be. That's not good. You were just fine living your life out here. Now you have to be annoying. Are you dead? That was so funny how I literally threw him into here. All right, where is this fire zombie? Maybe he's not on fire anymore. Nice! I feel like I recalled the weapon locker key being in a different place. Oh yeah, he's not on fire anymore. Much less powerful handgun than the other one. Oh, I love those slashes. Critical hit! I forget when the liquor comes in here. I'm scared. Oh, it's still here. Okay. I think you can just, like, keep... Just stand still and keep walking and the liquor won't care. Wait, this is the only time I need to come in here. Oh, I made a good call coming in here before triggering Mr. X, because Liquor plus Mr. X is not a great combo. I don't think I ever need to come back in here. Ah! They probably should have delayed that a bit longer, because people are just going to go right into their inventory. Oh my god, this camera. Oh, I'm cornered. <laughs> oh my god. You would never get this kind of experience in stock RE2. That's amazing. What this mod does to Lickers, Dogs, and Mr. X is cannot be overstated. That was glorious. All right, I have so much stuff I need to do. I need to put this into the box. I need to get the shotgun. I need to get the lion medallion. I need to go to the star's office. I need to pick up my kids. All right, this zombie in here is going to wake up, but I don't have enough to probably don't have enough to kill him just yet. Let me go and make some gunpowder. Or wait, let me see if I can get him down. Oh, nice, man. Okay. Let 
Liquor spawns in here at some point, but I don't know when. I think there's two liquors in here in the beast scenario as well. Leon reloads the shotgun so fast in this game. Like, where was that reload speed when I was playing RE4 Remake, Leon, huh? It's gunpowder time. Although, honestly, I'll probably just use the shotgun to kill any more zombies than I need to. Need that, need that. Might as well get rid of this, too. I need this. Oh my goodness, guys, we got the dongle. Getting it early to here too makes it easier to not forget to to use it in the underground. We can open the underground early as well, so we can have that at attachment. Although not that it's gonna help, because we're not even gonna have the Magnum for uh, the William boss fight, I don't think. Where do we get the Magnum in this mod? I forget. Oh, we get it from the stars up. No, we are gonna have it for the William Birkin one fight. Huh. That'll be fun. Holy shit, we're gonna be OP. Alright, crown fire borb. Okay. I don't think there are any zombies I need to fight in here, just that liquor. Oh wait, no, there's not gonna be a liquor up there. It's gonna be Mr. X. Not even gonna take any weapons. I don't have anything to shoot. Anything left to shoot. I will save though. Let's go! We are raw. We're going in raw. Raw WWE. Get it? Because Leon likes using wrestling moves. Leon, these are the women's showers. All right, Mr. Man. I wish he could actually follow you into the star's office because otherwise this, this part is just like kind of limp because you can do, just immediately run away to safety. Detonator. This is Carlos. Leon, you need the dongle. Your dongle's not good enough. Look at that rig. Jealous. Wonder how that rig would uh, run this game. Claire's memo. Oh, I love this. Claire's memo. Leon, I hope you find this. 
The station's done. Get out of here ASAP. Don't worry about me. I'll be all right. And don't stress about my brother either. Just focus on getting yourself out of here alive. Still don't know why they didn't use the radio that they have Marvin calling you with. All right. Here's my new best friend. The Desert Eagle, even though it's actually called Lightning Hawk in the original game, I believe. All right, unfondle the dongle. I don't even need to, I don't even need to go this way, but it, <laughs> to trigger him, but I might as well, because I need to freaking, I need to unlock that door. It's over here. Jesus Christ. Oh, that camera angles. Not very good for that reveal. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. You have a hat that I am very tempted to shoot off. Should have gone back to the star's office. Oh, God. Get down here. There's nowhere good that I can juke him along this path. I've <laughs> totally neglected to go back into the star's office. <laughs> All right, just please go down the hallway. Go somewhere else. All right, there you go. Good job. I hear him. I hear him going the uh, wrong way. I don't have anything to shoot him off, to shoot his hat off with, but my uh, lightning hawk, though. <laughs> uh, I don't think that's a very good uh, expenditure of a magnum round. Did I get the red herb that's over here? Yeah, I did. How did he even get in here if that door is locked? <laughs> How did you get over here? Fucking hacks, dude. I'm calling hacks. He literally teleported. There's literally no way he could have gotten over there. Go away. Look at this. There's literally nowhere he could have come in from. <laughs> what the fuck, RE2? Okay, uh, I got the detonator now. There's no good way back to an item box. So I guess I can go through the, the west office. Do I have anything else I could do? I think the uh, only thing I can do is just uh, blow up the, uh, the wall. When do I get the, uh, wait, where, when do I get the other keys, I wonder? The other keypad keys. I feel like I should have gotten one by now. Apparently there's still something in this room. Oh, uh, it's probably counting the upper hall. But there's a red herb. Where do you get the first key? Leon hasn't been teleporting lately, though, so that's a good sign. There's a glitch in the Matrix moment. Please don't come in here. He's probably right out here. Safety deposit room. It's not going to be in the safety deposit. I don't think it's in the library or the main hall.
Okay, I need to bring the shotgun so I can kill that one zombie. Let me load these bullets into this handgun. Let's take a first aid spray. Oh yeah, I need to... You need to bring a defensive item. Uh, <laughs> don't you? Otherwise you get insta-killed by Mr. X if he grabs you. Let me take that. I don't know where Mr. X is. Not like it matters, because he just teleports wherever he pleases. Okay, I would like to kill you early. Although doing so would probably draw Mr. X toward me. Nice. <laughs> oh great, that, that literally brought him right to me. Excellent. Where's he coming from? He's right around this corner. Oh jeez, did that hurt me? No, it didn't. Where is he? Hello? Um... He's not the sharpest tool in the shed, that's for sure! He just dipped. <laughs> Wait, I... Wait, where did he dip to? Because the shelf over here tipped over when you do that. Yeah, so he... Wait. Oh wait, no, did it tip over? No, it didn't. Wait, that's supposed to tip over, isn't it? Do I, I don't even need to fight the liquor at this rate. Fighting the liquor as Leon in the early game here is painful because his shotgun sucks. <laughs> um, Goat, harp, dove. Goated. Turn it into a shooting range. I, it tips over in the first scenario, but I don't know if it does that. It probably doesn't tip over in this scenario because then that would that might mess with Mr. X. Let's see if this guy's auto auto aggroed on me, or if I can just stay quiet. Or does he not show up in the B scenario? I don't know. I guess not. He definitely shows up later, but I don't know about right now. I think, think uh, the tyrant's in this room, so I should tread carefully. Okay. Oh! I heard him somewhere. I love the camera angles in the library. Alright, I need to get the lion one now. I don't want to leave to the underground though without first getting one of the keypad keys because I swear I should have gotten one by now. What was it? Lion, crown, fire, and then... Uh, bird?
Okay, I have all the medallions now, but I'm not exactly comfortable moving forward yet. Let's see, you get you get the key, uh, you get the key from um, the uh, puzzle box thing in the first scenario. Wait, did they move the puzzle box into the locker room? Let me offload these two. I also have the feeling that it might have been somewhere over here that I missed, but it's not showing any items that I didn't pick up. So, maybe not. Mr. X's pathfinding has been very kind to me here. Oh, he's right in here, though. Oh, I hear him. Uh, no, I didn't think it would be in here. Huh, maybe I don't get it until after the Birkin one. So I think the only thing left of the library is just that one piece of handgun ammo that's under the bookcase. <laughs> Why was he making any noise? Wait, what happens if I turn on if I go on the laptop right now? He's power walking at me. Nope, I can't. <laughs> I, I thought I would be able to do something cheeky, like turn, look at the laptop, and then he despawns, and I when I see him on the laptop. I want to check in the library one more time though, because I feel like I missed the moved puzzle box somewhere. Whoa! Why are my controls not responding? I don't think I can even move this without the the jack. Oh, I actually can, but I don't have time to. Whoa, buddy. Okay, this is gonna trigger this zombie, but uh, I'll deal with it. I interrupted his feeding time! Leon, please. Why is my is my analog stick glitching out? Ah! Okay, I just want to make sure that this is Yeah, okay, that's the only thing that was in here. Okay. Uh must not get it until uh after you uh come back from the underground. Yeah, the art room is showing as clear. This hallway is showing as not clear, but I think that's only because there's a red herb at the other end of it that I can't reach yet. Okay, let me go back and get that other medallion. I'm glad I waited really long to actually trigger him because that made the RPD a lot, a lot less stressful than it would have been.
there is that room in the stars hallway that does have the key pad, uh, one keypad key in it, but you need the diamond key for that. When are zombies gonna come through here? Damn, I feel like they should have come through already. And I literally don't have any more windows to board up after this one, so... Wait. Does Leon get access to the boards that board up the other, the last window that I would need to? Yeah, he does, so I'm gonna board this one up just in case. Wait, there's another one. Oh, you can't board that one up. Okay, just to be safe, just board up all of these. Just use up every board on every possible window I can use them on. Okay. Um, I don't want to save, because I'm going to save when I get in there. So I need to not take a hit. They bring the star stars badge as well, before I forget. We're doing pretty good on resources, going into Birkin 1. Where is he? Where is he going to be? Yeah, the board above the chief's office. I can't juke him in this hallway because I left two legless zombies in the uh, in the east office. The camera turns to make for some fantastic jump scares like that, though. Alright, thankfully he's nowhere to be seen. In the B scenario, funnily enough, I think Mar the zombie is like, at least Marvin zombie can come down here, which is weird. Let me tr do a little bit of trolling and see if Mr. X can come down here. After I get all set up. Not sure how, not sure what I want to use for the Birkin 1 fight here. I think I want to still try using the knife strat. But I feel like I don't want to use the shotgun here because you have to get so close to him here to for the shotgun to be effective. And that's just like not a good idea with Birkin 1. So I feel like I'm just going to use knife, knife, handgun, and the magnum because I'm going to get the attachment for it. So we're going to be in a very good rip, uh, place. So I will need... Flash bang for that. Let me also get my frag here. Get that fully loaded. Probably don't want to spend more than a full mag. Use up all the handgun ammo first, and then I'll knife first, then handgun ammo, then I'll use the magnum to clean them up. Oh, Mr. Xy. <laughs> Damn, tumbled down the stairs. Okay, he can't come down here. Loser. <laughs> Knocked your hat off. He 
He takes a lot of firepower to actually be stunned. Better get moving. Shut up. <laughs> Whoa! Just don't do that. <laughs> so jarring. Is Leon gonna start teleporting again? I hope not. Love these elevators. I still need to actually shoot off his hat at some point. Ari for Leon face. Yeah, that's a mod that I have on. Woo, so hype that we can get this early. What does that even do? Just more damage in general. Hell yeah, I'll take it. Oh, that makes it large though. Damn. Elongate the Magnum. A wooga, a wooga, a wooga. <laughs> You're really gonna make me hold A on it. Oh yeah, Leon actually has to move it out of the way on like Claire. He's got bulletproof vest. Jesus. Okay, let's see. No choice. Gotta take it down. Yeah. Street Fighter style. Worth it. Alright, now you can have a grenade. Or you can have my knife, that's fine too. I need to go around and pick up the hanging ammo. I need to wait for him to throw a tantrum and start whacking with the pipe so I have time to go and pick, the, pick it up. There we go. Get the hang and ammo. Now get out before I get myself cornered. Oh! Oh, he's smart. He's a smart noodle. This guy sticks to you like blue. Uh, imagine not playing this with tank controls, good god. <laughs> Leon, aim at the eye. He's already super low health. Oh, get this. Hang on, Emma, now. Well, what are you doing over here? I am having a lot of trouble aiming at the eye. He keeps targeting his head. Oh, God damn, that knife. I That knife put in some work.
somebody maybe I need to turn down the auto aim ray He falls off like that because he's a clumsy bitch. I didn't even use the magnum there. <laughs> he really needs to fix the freaking quick turning there whenever I move the stick. RE4 HD project? I have in the past, yeah. Although it's a the file size is insane, so I had to make some sacrifices at some point, so I had to uninstall it. I don't have it anymore. Are we gonna see Leon's sweetheart of the night soon? Buyer sell OG RE4 versus RE4 mate? Would buyer sell? I'm gonna sell, I'm gonna save after the, after I get back from the Ben cutscene. I wonder how they- how do they motion capture characters' tongues, I wonder? How does that work? I'll be more fucking kidding me, mate. But slow on the reaction time there, Leon. Hey. Who is that? Stay sharp. Whoa. So Leon points his gun at everybody he meets. Looking stunning. Thank you. For your help. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Why I never? Hey! I'm not done talking to you! The amazing teleporting Ada.
It's not exactly the dark side design. It's the OG design with the uh, with the gloves and um, her harness that she wears uh, normally. There's no way to like mod her to actually wear normal shoes like she does in the OG game, since she's always animated uh, animated around having high heels. Yeah. We got a mod for Ben that f changes his color scheme to match the original. Real human. <laughs> Hello, human. You've been here long? Long enough. Are we the last ones alive? No, no, there's a few of us. <laughs> That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's of course Iron sent you. Irons. You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. I have no idea why they killed Ben here. Hey. Considering you have to come back here later anyway. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. Because Ada doesn't even get no to talk to him. Believe me. Sorry. I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in the station. He didn't yeah, he Come didn't out. have his cigarettes confiscated. Shit. It's coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on, don't be an asshole. Hey, you need this! Just get me the fuck out of here! Who is that? Leon, chill me. the fuck out. He literally gu points his gun at everybody. I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? It was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. She got her hairstyle changed to match your OG look as well. Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Ada Wong. I don't, to be honest, I don't know why everybody likes Leon. this voice actress for her so much. Like, she sounds nothing like the original. <laughs> that said, she is way better acted. Like, acting-wise, she's way better than the RE4 make actress. Well, I guess the deal's on. She just doesn't match Ada, how Ada should sound, for my taste. Uh, what in the world? But they had fun modeling that. Crank! Lovely. Yeah, always crashing cars to always pointing his gun at people. Not very polite, is it? Now I will go save after we got all that stuff done. Should probably... We're gonna fight dogs. I should probably bring my standard handgun. I'm gonna run out of ammo for this eventually. Maybe bring a healing item as well. Wait, I still have those first aid sprays. That should be enough. Keep that. Extended mag for the handgun? Oh yeah, that's where you get it for- get this for Leon, isn't it? Wait, it already has the extended mag. What attachment do you get here? 
as Leon. Or does Leon even get the car keys? Hey, there aren't any liquors in here for Leon. Love that shimmer. Does he get the stock this early? It would be mighty convenient if he did. It would be very good for the dogs coming up. In fact, I think I'll save the... Uh, Save the 45 caliber handgun for the dog since it's stronger. And I'll use the uh, BP-70 on the zombies in here. Excellent. You know what? This is what sucks. Like, if you kill all the dogs that are in the cages here, like, that doesn't affect the count of dogs that show up later in any way. I have the square crank, don't I? I can open this, right? Yeah. All right, fellas, let's party. No, not you. Wait, do you have something next to you? Yes, you have a flash grenade. Where's the red herb, though? There she is. Wow, Leon's handgun's really weak. Claire was popping off zombies left and right. You better be dead. I'm just gonna move this in case you aren't. <laughs> no! Alright. We eat the herb. Oh, fuck you. Well, I, uh, I guess my timing on that was good. The noises Leon makes in this game. Oh, fuck. That zombie's gonna be harassing me. I need to get through here quick. Because he can open that door. Is there an herb I can get over here? No. Oh, there's an urban here, I think. Somewhere. 
There it is. Oh god, just use it, Leon! Use the herb! Hold on. I'll use up this handgun ammo and then I can pick it up. Ah, oh, but I gotta pick up this shit too! Fuck. Okay, you know what? We're just going back to the item box. Ah, uh, but then I, then this uh this buff that I have here will go to waste. Uh, so annoying. Okay, free up space. Use, reload. Use that herb. Grab that item. Is the way we'll do it. Doggos. This handgun's really good against them. Okay, now I will heal. Excellent, now I can pick this up. Uh, problem is I don't have any more ammo to spare to kill this dog, so let's run through here while my buff is still active. Ah! <laughs> Woo! Ouch. That went well. Okay. Um, I am very low on handgun ammo. Should keep this first aid spray with me. That's a save right there. Are there gonna be any more zombies? I'm gonna take the shotgun just in case. Because my handgun's not gonna be enough. So many greens, I might as well just uh, combine some and heal. Where are my shotgun shells? There they are. I have so many. God damn. I played the early game really well to have this amount of resources. Yeah, RE2 Make is what I'd say is a phenomenal game, but it's not exactly a good remake. It's a good... it has a lot of things that are really... A lot of elements that make for a genius remake, it just like, that's not like applied to the whole game. Like it's very hit or miss on, RE2 make is very inconsistent on like, how good of a remake it can be. At times RE2 make is like, the most genius remake I've ever seen, but more often it's, more often it's like, very mid, and then sometimes it's like, terrible. Like with the, the, the uh, zapping and the scenarios. And the story. But the genius moments I must uh, give credit for are pretty genius, like uh, how they handle the liquor in the B scenario here, and how they handle Mr. X as well. This is what I've been saving the shotgun for. Where's you? Is it, where, where did you even come from? Where did these guys come from? Who let these guys in? Leon, aim at the guy's head, please. There we go.
What they did with the handguns in the second scenario as well is another thing that I would I would definitely say is a stroke of genius. The headshots and the fixed camera angle here is just as satisfying as the original game. Um, what do I even need to do? I need to use the... I need to go unlock the diamond key doors. So that is going upstairs, and I'm gonna go to the uh, west wing first. Yeah, RE2 make definitely doesn't really innovate. Uh, the, I'd say the only part RE2 make really innovates over the original is the... The level design is generally much greater in scope than the original game is. The original game tends to fall into like very linear trappings a lot of the time. And I think this remake does still have some of that those trappings at, at points. But in general, I'd say the level design and uh, progression has improved over the original. Is Mr. X gonna be here? I don't know. So I'm gonna get one of the keypad keys here. I think I'm gonna get the other one in the uh, interrogation room. That was a hard one. This feels like a police station to you? This map? I, I don't know how this... I mean, it should feel feel like a police station. And it feels exactly as it should. It feels like a police station uh, converted from a museum. Uh, what? I don't know what police stations you're thinking of that look like this in real life. Just install the mod to skip this. Hey, just because you have a skill issue solving that puzzle doesn't mean I do. Alright. Um. Can I... I? I'm gonna go downstairs to hopefully get the other key, pad key as well. Is the liquor still in here? Yep, he's just vibing. We'll leave him alone. Okay. Um... Let me get the boards that are up here, so I can board up that window that's down there. Is Mr. X gonna announce his grand re-entrance here? Oh, he's not gonna show up until the helicopter bit, isn't he? 
He's gonna reintroduce himself there. I should play the uh, restoration of uh, Resident Evil 1.5. Um, I don't think I have enough ammo to kill these guys, and I don't think I can... I don't have access to a knife, so I'll just headshot them. So loud and noisy! Stop it. I will shoot you a couple of times, though, actually, since I need to free up the inventory space. Maybe we'll get a headshot. Shit. Can I get the can I get a what a what the Leon? Where'd he go? Get over here. Aim for the head, Leon. Leon head. <laughs> that worked out. You're still alive though, aren't you? Okay, that worked out perfectly. I need a lot more inventory space though, so I can pick up the the uh, cog. I can't go in there. Claire, let me in. I need access to the item box. Oh god, I gotta go so far to get back to the item box. Eh! Ring-a-ding-ding-ding-ding. I like that camera angle. <laughs> Ring-a-ding-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling. -a what zombie actually did end up coming behind this window here? Just this one? Well, that was the first one I boarded up, so I made a good call there. I'm gonna wait until I get the other key, keypad key, and just uh, do them both together. That is a wet camera there. It's a, it's raining so aggressively all the time in this game. How is Raccoon City not flooded? Okay, you are not getting into my humble abode. No, thank you. Where's the liquor gonna be in here without the mirror jump scare? Oh wait, I don't have the clip key yet, right. Where do I get the clip key? Oh yeah, I get it outside. I have to put out the fire first though, right? Oh wait, no, I have to go down the ladder up here. Why did they block this route off for Leon, by the way? Why doesn't this happen to Claire? Damn it. 
Ah, heck. Ah, fiddlesticks. Oh god, I really want a mod that removes the rain. It's like so distracting. Maybe it's just the game's RE2 makes horrible aliasing, but it's like, <laughs> it just makes the entire screen shimmer with jaggies. That's one, and that's bullshit, is what that is. What part did I actually end up hitting? <laughs> well, that's why I have this first aid spray. Okay, here it is. Someone lose a key? Yes, I did. Thank you. I'm not even bothering to take my handgun out because I don't have enough ammo to even kill a single zombie with it. I guess I'll load it anyway. Just keeping the shotgun with me for any zombies. Did I not? I didn't put out the fire. Oops. So shimmery. Maybe I should install a reshade. He makes his re-entrance! Well, hello, Mr. Handsome Walking Stud. Nice hat you have there. It would be a shame if something happened to it. Uh, what, else, what do I need to do now? I need to go down and unlock the club key door now. I guess they broke the ladder there, so you have to go back through here to get to the club key door. Otherwise, you could just skip Mr. X entirely. I actually want him to break the wall down here, because that would be convenient for me. A shortcut. Where's the liquor? Oh, there's the other one. Okay. Liquor is on this side of the wall in the original game. Uh, when you come in without the glass being broken.
Oh boy, it's everyone's favorite puzzle again. Mm. Uh, all right, there we go. Got both of them. Hope he breaks open the wall, so that'll save me some time going back. Oh, come on, dude. Wake up, you lazy bum. Where even is he? He has to be, like, really close by, because otherwise that would have triggered. Oh, please, oh, for God's sake. Why are you here of all places? Where can I even juke him? I. Oh my God, I literally don't even have anywhere to juke him around here. I have to. F oh yeah, I forgot to get the, the, the uh, clock tower gear up there. I need to get that. He's gonna make me go all the way back here and then wait for him. Cause I can't juke him around here at all. Oi. Yeah. Now I gotta slowly follow after him. All this because he didn't want to break open the wall. That's okay because I still need to pick up the gear anyway. Oh, if I had room for it, that is. Good God. <laughs> what a shit show. Should I go next just to save time? I don't I'm not going into the hallway of hell without saving first. Oh wait, there's an iron box down here. Right. Go away. feel like saving yet all righty see you later fuffy leon no <laughs> don't run right into him Why is he going the way I need to go?
All right, we've become the stalker now. We're stalking him. Hello? He's gonna have to come back through here because there's a dead end the way where he is right now. Oh my god, you're being such a bitch right now. <laughs> That's the walk you do when you want to talk to someone's manager. Holy shit. Mr. X is like the ultimate video game Karen, if you think about it. I mean, who wears a hat like that? That's like wearing that is like uh, asking to be called like the male version of a uh, Karen. Where's the, where's all the stuff that's in here? There's the, there's the gear and then I don't think, I don't know if there's anything else. I haven't gotten in here yet. That's everything. Oh my God, you could not have shown up in a worse place. There you are. <laughs> He's sticking in me like glue. It's a like it's a debt built up from the easy time that I had at the the start of the game. Okay, to the safety deposit room. Oh, there might be liquor in here. Yep, there he is. That that guy needs to something needs to happen to that guy. But I don't have great weapons to deal with them. I could just shoot him with the magnum. I'd probably be honestly, just like a single magnum shot would probably be a more efficient use of resources compared to the shotgun, because the magnum has its attachment and the shotgun has nothing. Um, are those the only ones? There's also a 208 or 209. Okay, that should be everything. All right, there we go. Nice, got all that knocked out at once. Okay, let me go fetch my magnum to get rid of this. Pest! The less time I have to spend fighting him too, the less chance Mr. X has to fuck me over. I should probably save though. Actually, I'll save after I kill him, then I'll prepare for the hallway of hell. Oh, of course you're out here now.
Sounds like he's upstairs. I might have time to kill the slicker. Ah, oh, but not if you go all the way back here. Oh my god, why are you going all the way over here? Get over here. That didn't kill you. Two magnum rounds? Maybe I had to shoot him in the head. Oh man, he didn't even hear any of that. Now I will save. Time for the hallway of hell. I'll pack a flash for this. Although, I have to go back to the main hall to get there. Maybe back a first aid spray too. similar mods are planned for R3 remake yeah would be nice to have a mod like this for that game too Mr. X isn't anywhere nearby so he's gonna teleport to me anyway but uh I can get through here without having to run at least before the zombies show up yep okay there they are they didn't let me board these up earlier but now they're broken Fuck you. There's two liquors, good god. All way of hell. Never disappoint. Zombie, can you please? God, Claire has it so easy for this room. Is Mr. X not gonna teleport over here? Oh, yep, he's on me. God damn it. This is gonna be really rough. I hear his theme. Where is he? Hello? Why did I hear his theme, but he's nowhere to be found? Alright then. Didn't even have to use a flash there. Buddy usually teleports over to you. Okay, now I can go up to the clock tower. I think that's everything I need to do otherwise. Oh no! I forgot some gunpowder in the generator room. That's gonna bug me forever. I can get that when I next, uh... I can get that when I next go to the underground. That's fine. Let's get up there while he's not anywhere near me, apparently. Oh, he's down there. This other zombie appears aggro. Oh, wait, did I kill him? Oh, I think I shot his head off. Wrong way, dipshit. Ah! <laughs> That's close. Look at him, he's so mad. Need to remember to shoot this zombie in the leg this time. Thank you.
All right. Oh fuck! I forgot the large gear. I'm such an idiot. Don't worry, guys. I know what I'm doing. I'm good at this game. Ah! <laughs> Why are you right there? You bitch. You have lost your hat wearing privileges after that. <laughs> Loser. Does a superhero jump down? I do not want to go down to the freaking. I don't want to go back to the dark room. I'm just gonna get cornered by him in there and wait for him. I'll have to wait for him to leave. I think I have this item box down here now. Any more first aid sprays? I am first aided out. Let's get a buff going, just because I feel like it. Whoops. I wanna save this knife for the sewers. All right, let's get the gear this time, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, why are you still here? Really? He's just intimidating me now. Beyond's looking so sassy from this angle. Can you leave, you stompy ass bitch? Really? You, have, you want me to stand in a corner for 30 seconds? Alright, guys, you play hide and seek. One, two, three. Four. All right, shoot the zombie in the leg. Take two. He's not even nearby. You can just run right in. Where's the smaller gear? It's uh, upstairs, isn't it? See you later, cartographer. Hope you have a good one.
I don't have to write a report on this. <laughs> oh, Leon. Oh, you charmer. Okay, now we just go back down to the basement. Hi. Can you go away? Fucking Mr. X is out there too, really? Is he where I need to go? I can't tell. I can't see where he is. No. Stop it. Oh, I see him. <laughs> Down there in the lower frame. Where's the other zombie that's up here? There you are. Ah, there you are. He stumbled forward so far from that that th I might as well not have even shot him. To go to the under, underground again. We need to go to the blah 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 the back to the break room. Hi, blah blah blah. <sighs> Leon's seen better days. Glad I cleared out all these bozos, otherwise I would be in a bit of a pinch. Okay, zombie comes out of that window. And this window here. I think those are the only two windows in the hallway that matter. Could leap down and grab your leg. Oh yeah, that was pretty annoying though when that happened, because that was just like taking damage to RNG. Although you did get a free zombie kill out of that, because you stomped their head out. They can still grab you in the same way, though, if they're crawling on the ground in this game. Let's get the little cubic devices. What other? I'll need a flash grenade. I have a flash grenade. I might need a shotgun to kill a zombie in my way. Well, we'll see. Need to pick up that gunpowder that I missed as well. Let me take a healing item too. Key door have it not opened yet. Did I not open, not open this one? Oh goody, zombies. Zombies in my Resident Evil game? What the frick? How dare you? Okay, there we go. Red herb, I need that. No, I'm not picking that up. I already got what what's uh, what that's used for. You can take your film and shove it. There's still gonna be dogs in this hallway, right? Yep. Oh yeah, there are gonna be dogs in here as well, frick. Glad I brought the shotgun. Wait, I don't even need to kill these guys, although I probably should. Um, excellent, that's lovely. Yeah, let's not. No, I needed that.
Lovely. Leon looks like he's fresh out of a pool. The, the characters always look like that. With the um, rain in this game. What did you think of OGRE3? It's in my top five Resident Evil games. I love it. Do I have... Uh, I don't have any 45 caliber ammo, so I'll need to... I'm, I don't feel like using shotgun ammo on these guys. I'm going to make some regular hanging ammo. That should be enough. No, why are you over here this time? Oh god, that was such a waste. Shit. Ah, um, what are my reaction times? of a bitch. I don't feel like taking a hit here. I've already taken enough hits. That fucking dog RNG though, where I had to waste some bullets on that idiot. Let me take this handgun with me. He's now he's not here. That's good. Fucking thing. Good enough. There's gonna be a green herb as soon as you get out of the parking garage here, anyway. Leon, the technician. Oh yeah, you have, you have, you have to make this one so weird to get it right.
the fence, so hiding a first aid spray behind his toilet. Sassy Ben. Hmm. What are That's not good. <laughs> Leon cut himself off. Sexy Xy. Oh no, it's not this room that has the freaking hole that you can walk through. There's the next one. Thank you. Whee! I have not played Shenmue, but it does look interesting. I think I would like it. Mr. X got the dubstep theme. You're keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Down here. Imagine if that hit Leon in the face, and then she's like, "Well, oops." Take it, you have the key card. Yeah, and this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. Good thing we'll never see him again. We might want to open the shutter. We might. Do we? Are we sure? Her hair? That's uh, how she looks in OG. That's her hairstyle that she has in the OG game and in RE4. It's cons actually consistent between the two. Oh gosh, she's one of those NPCs that walks slower than me. Oh god, it's moist time. Moistening. Is that the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. Oh god, I really wish there were actual zombies out here so we could fight oh, together with exactly Ada. Are you, looking for? you never actually fun. get to fight She's alongside her, nice. like in the OG game. What about she you? looks like a woman I picked up in Mexico once. Yeah, well, well, that's a very uh, specific. To the authorities. We need reinforcements to save this city. I'm walking faster than you. Why is there a giant sinkhole in Raccoon City, by the way? Did they ever, did they ever explain that in this game? Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. Oh, I like that. I like those shadows. Kendo, your 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 signage is blinding me, dude. What a mess. Ballistics. <laughs> That was actually introduced in RE4, the ballistics and ammunition. What did the magnum ammo look like in OG RE2? It was just, they were just the uh, entire clips of magnum ammo, weren't they, in that game? 
Don't mind if I do. Oh boy, it's Jill's note. Oh yeah. Can't wait to see the scene where Jill actually writes this in RE3 Remake. Kendo, it looks like you got your reason for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Blah, 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 blah. Thank you, Jill. Said, don't move. Just like Ben, Kendo's here, has got a mod here to make his color scheme match the original more. Right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. She looks almost as hungry as me. Tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. Wouldn't be a Leon introduction if you weren't pointing his gun at someone. This is fucking daughter. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. I don't know why Kendo is pointing his gun at us. Like, I feel like Kendo is confused at what series he's in. He thinks he's in The Walking Dead. Who are you? What are you doing here? You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? Man, I don't know shit. I'm just a glorified just Uber driver. I'm glad they did give they they gave Kendo more screen time and they made good use of him because they uh Use this to further Leon and Ada's development of each other, and, uh, Leon's arc. God, the rain just ruins every cutscene that is present in. Also, why is- why is Kendo now soaking wet? Well, I guess he's kind of wet. It's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. <laughs> the game get developed in the shadow in the shower. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. May not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. I hear a crow. The Umbrella Corporation. Let me shoot it. They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. No, it doesn't, Leon. It's the T virus, not the G virus. I I, I still don't know why they like they never <laughs> they don't ever mention the T virus in this game. Except on a loading screen. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. We actually move at the same speed when we're going downstairs. Can't wait to play as Ada. We need a mod that makes Ada a pointer gun like the she does in uh, OG. Slightly slanted. This is how we get to Annette. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. I love the sewers. I can't imagine a real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? 
Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Hashtag get money out of politics. That's the message of this game. Why did they not put freaking zombies in here? Like, seriously. <laughs> Jesus. Give me, give me something to do. Instead of just listening to these two. Oh boy. Are you guys ready for my favorite part of the game? This is uh, the point where I realized this remake wasn't the one. This remake was not my true love. Is there an increment here? Yeah, there's an increment out here, I think. Why did they put the increment all the way over here? Probably make some space in my inventory because I need to pick stuff up on the way to the next item box. Probably want to keep the shotgun with me. Wait, I still have the diamond key. <laughs> oh, did I forget? I didn't. I forgot to go inside of the. Uh... Well, that's gonna. That is a uh, very cursed. I forgot to get the red herb inside of that room again when I reloaded. No, I'm not a real gamer. Again? It's not too late to turn back, Leon. No chance. You're stuck with me to the end. Ugh. Ugh. You sure this is the right way? Unfortunately. Apparently not, because Ada just finds another way around. Please don't change this to 2D controls randomly. Please let me keep my tank controls. Because uh, this is gonna go very, very bad if you make me use 2D controls. Uh, nope, it's 2D controls. Yep, thanks for that. Thanks for changing my control scheme. Holy shit. Make me love this section even more. Om um, num num. It'd be cute to keep as a pet. I don't know why this mod changes my control scheme when I'm like in the sections where you're playing a sherry carrying sherry and here like is, Can you just not put our the control settings that we have into these sections? Is that just not possible? Because it's very very jarring Chance. You're stuck with me to the end. Holy shit! Take away all the stinky bits on it, it's actually kind of cute. You like size him down, he'd be like a little rar monster. I like what the camera angles do to this though. Makes it a little bit more cinematic, which is the best you can do with this. 
Why is there a grenade there? <laughs> Chew on that, you overgrown son of a bitch. Wah, wah, wah. Hey, Ada. Now you can actually see Ada. I like this camera angle. The fixed camera definitely does improve this section, minus randomly changing my control scheme. Just get up here. Move. Can't say I didn't warn you. You said the virus turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. I did not. I lost a piece of myself, thinking of what could have been. That could have been like the the alligator could have legit legitimately made for the best single best part of an RE2 remake, but instead it makes for the single worst part. So let me get this There's straight. so much you could have done with the alligator. Like it could have been like Our the military? the peak of the game. Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. And Annette is who makes the viruses. As scary as that alligator was. The net is far more dangerous. The alligator wasn't scary. He was alright. Uh, it expected me to keep the ink ribbons in my inventory. Oops! If I get killed by Ada, I have to go back now. And do that again. If I get killed as Ada. Identify yourself. Net Firkin. She's who we're looking for? Not much time. Don't worry about it, that's just how Leon we greets people. Of it. We're here for the G virus. <laughs> that's not gonna happen. I'm warning you, Doctor. Oh yeah? Hey! Stop! Stop! Ada! Expect that from a scientist? Uh, you should have. Leon, forget about me. I'm so sassy today. Just go. Sorry. Stop her before she gets away. Oh. Pay no mind to how Ada pulls a uh, coat out of nowhere. I'm right outside the facility, in pursuit of a net. Not on her. It must be in the nest. Crispy. Once it's in hand, I'll call for extraction. You can run, Annette. Yes, Queen. Let's go. Secret weapon time. Secret weapon time. Could this really not have been done in fixed camera? I have, I don't imagine it would have been that that weird. Like you just shine it around like you do a flashlight, and then it becomes visible. That's probably outside of them. Well, I'm just theoretically how you could do it. The modder yeah, probably hasn't found a way to do it yet. More roaches that I wish I could fight instead of just running past. that look. Is there anything in here? Nope. All right. Fuck. I actually forget what I need to do here. Shit. 
should have done that before. I like getting Ada's handgun here. God, it's so noisy. Oh, I, I should probably take your legs out. Where is the thing that I need to hit here? Oh god, I'm not used to non-inverted from this perspective. Barely see him there. Thank you, Caesar. Oh, here it is. Or so I think. Baby. What do I actually do here? I thought I was supposed to hit that thing. Why is my reticle down there? Why is my reticle up there now? Oh shit, shit's fucked up. Look at that, Ada doesn't even recoil. Those are some headshots for days. Uh, my reticle isn't even on screen now. Yeah, I'm supposed to be able to hit this thing, but my reticle isn't on screen. Who who took my reticle? Where's my my soft locked? Oh, you can actually spin way faster if you hold both sticks down. <laughs> it's funny. Still streaming? I mean, it hasn't been that long since you left. Yeah, I think I'm soft locked. The, uh... The reticle has left me. <laughs> what if I cheese it and, like... Look backwards. Damn 
Oh, oh boy. Chance. You're stuck with me to the end. La 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 left. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. Holy shit. Barely see my laser sight there. I will actually save at the typewriter this time. Chew on that, you overgrown son of a bitch. Ada, my love. Say I didn't warn you. You said the virus turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. I will use my newfound knowledge of the spin to keep myself entertained. Hold both opposite directions. I do this Amongst weirdness. Monsters like that to who? Our military? Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. And Annette is who makes the viruses. Scary as that alligator was, Annette is far more dangerous. Save. So I don't have to do that again. Secret weapon time. Net, but you can't hide. It's secret weapon time. Okay, can I not lose my reticle this time? Do not fall off of the screen this time, please. Can you see what you're supposed to hit from here? No, that's way over there. What are you made of? God damn.
Okay, can I have my reticle? Oh jeez, it's sliding. It's sliding away. We gotta make this quick. Oh fuck. Where is it? Screw off. What? Are you still alive? Are you serious? I love RNG zombie health. I actually do like how the zombie health is RNG because it keeps things very tense. It just can be surprising at times. Stop sliding away, please. Does Ada ever get any healing items? Persistent bastard, aren't you? Come on. Oh my God. What is this stupid shit? Oh, come on, dude. <sighs> you can run, Annette, but you can't hide. It's secret weapon time. I like this segment, honestly. It's just the annoying in this mod when shit's broken. Oops, I did not mean to do that. It seems like switching back and forth from the handgun is what causes it, which is unfortunate, because I want to shoot stuff. Hello, can your legs break please? Thank you. Lady, I need you to stop speeding. This is no speeding- oh fuck. No speeding zone. Good god, I'm getting some horrible RNG this time. That was not a good use of that. Oh, come on, that doesn't even blow his head off. Oh, 
always been good at running. Oh, please, dude. Come on. Can you just stay in the center of the screen? This is fucking ridiculous. Thanks. I wanted to go that way anyway. Oh, good lord! I, know I literally have to turn this mod off to get through this section. Me enable the disable mod when aiming thing. Disable mod while aiming. That is gonna be jarring as heck. You can run, Annette, but you can't hide. It's secret weapon time. I haven't seen any uh, anyone else talk about this. I wonder if this is an issue introduced in this version. Because it was updated today. I remember to, yeah. Oh God, having to aim with non inverted controls, which is what I'm used to. have blood on you, Ada. Why are you here, lady? Thought she only awoke if I went over by where she is. That was close. 
Why are you still alive? Holy fuck, the zombies in this section are made of titanium. Hello, lol, dude. It looks polished. Yeah, the, like, 95% of the mod is polished. Uh, he just happened to tune into the part where I got soft locked because it broke. And I have to, I had to, to take the option to have the mod disabled when aiming because it kept soft locking me with this, with Ada's uh, hacking gun. Because the reticle kept going off screen. Pele, the beloved dog? Who the hell is Pele? Thank you for the ink ribbon. Now I can try actually playing the mod with the, the way it's uh, meant to be played again. Why did it give me handgun ammo there? I don't have anything left to shoot. I guess to shoot a Mr. X. Town missions in 06? Oh man, I don't remember that. They did indeed, lol dude. <clears throat> Mod has been fantastic, aside from, you know, soft locking me here. Hello, Dead End. Not looking good, Ada. You could use a first aid spray. Where's Leon? 
How would I frame it? How would I frame a Halo Resident Evil mod? That's a big question to think about. The fun of it would be that it wouldn't be exactly like Resident Evil. The fun of it would be adapting the mechanics into Halo's framework and see what comes out the other end. Ada? Damn it. Ah, oh, fiddlesticks. Ada? Where are you? Okay. Back to the fun part of the game. Not necessarily. It doesn't have to be, like, super action-oriented. Depends. Depends how well, what, what I'd be trying to do with it. Splish, splash, splish, splash. Hello. Boom. I see you up there. I see you up there with magic auto aiming powers. <laughs> he came and he went. Goodbye, little dude. You're not alive? Oh. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Oh wow. This handgun is ungodly. Oh my god! Let's make all this RNGs making up for the struggles I had with Ada. I think, uh, I'm, I, I need to leave the Rook plug in there because I still need to access the door. We cursed water park. Oh, yeah, I need to get around this thing. 
Could I kill this thing? I, with the, just the shotgun? Oh. Shooting his weak point. <laughs> In fact, I can't really aim at anything other than the weak point. There we go. Nah, I can't. I don't have enough firepower to kill it. Got alerted over here. Come on, get back up. Need you to get closer than that. There we go. There we go. Ah, stop it. Our engine games have a habit of like everything, the every little action the enemies perform make you stumble, especially RE4 remake. Any zombies up here in the second scenario? There aren't. Nice. This room is full of zombies in the first scenario. S Z F. Glad I had space for that. I don't like the sound of that. And I can actually, I'll actually watch the videotapes as Leon now. Is he actually, player has like no commentary of work, any value to them, whereas Leon actually does. I do like how they they put the all the flashbacks, the big flashback exposition scene into these videotapes. That's a much more intelligent way of handling all this, uh, this part of the story. Virus. I'll bet those rats spread it. What virus, Leon? The G virus? <laughs> All right, I have fuck all ammo. To be honest, I, I, I'm tempted to just use the shotgun and going ham on every zombie I see, but let me see what kind of gunpowder I got. Honestly, I don't really... How much shotgun ammo do I have? I don't want to use uh, the gunpowder to make any shotgun ammo. I'm good on shotgun ammo. I'm just going to use it to make handgun ammo. 
and then save the rest of my gunpowders for Magnum. Was that all of my small gunpowder? Do I have any more gunpowder larches? No? Okay. Probably have to take the shotgun anyway. Oh, I can make more. I still have a one gunpowder here. There we go. That should be well enough. All right, let's save, and off on our merry way we go. Attachment is waiting for me in here again. Two twelve eight. Oh, yes, thank you. I don't know why they put the combination right on the safe. Claire's Note, part two. Leon, I found a I have had to take a little detour to help the girl I found. If I don't save her, I have I hate to think what might happen. You go on ahead, you're almost out of the city now. Don't worry about me. I'll make it out, promise. I don't know why why would Claire even think Leon would come here? <laughs> Zombies! Oh my god, I'm getting headshots for days all of a sudden. Those are some juicy knife slashes there. This is the knife gameplay I was missing in the RE4 remake. Yeah, get those wide-reaching knife slashes. That's what I like to see. Is there a second one that comes in here for Leon? There might be. That would be problematic. Love the music cue there. It's perfect. Uh, 
Okay, now to save again. I didn't pick up the sink ribbon. All right. Um, I think I'm gonna be. F there might be more zombies spawned in here. Excellent. As so literally, did they? Did they just recycled this shotgun model for the RE4 remake. Even though the RE4 remake shotgun looks a little bit different, like it's uh, the under sort of cylinder there is a lot shorter. Please don't spawn another one. No! I need you to come over here. Leon? There we go. There we go. A little bit more. Oh, stop spitting out babies. Get over here. You gotta be kidding me. No, okay, that was, that could have been really bad if I accidentally climbed down there. If, uh, if I actually accidentally climbed down earlier. Wait, what? That wasn't even the one I was fighting. That was the fucking other one that was closer to me. Okay, never mind. I'm killing this fucker. I am killing this motherfucker. Has to be done. God, all of Leon's guns take up so much space once they're upgraded. Like, literally every one of his guns take up two spaces by the end of the game. It's rough. Let's see, I should prob- let's see, I, I don't actually know which one I want to kill. I, I have to just say I should kill this one. I can't see. There we go. This 
This is not a good angle to be fighting this thing. I need a better camera angle. Oh my god, dude, what were my shotgun shots even hitting there? Yeah, he needs to he needs to change the camera angle here so we can actually see and shoot at the weak point. It definitely does, Ultra Beast, it definitely does on standard, but you get uh, less hit pouches on hardcore. Actually, actually, much prefer the amount of hit pouches you give you. They give you on hardcore because standard, standard's inventory upgrades are way too forgiving. I mean, standard is way too forgiving for this game. Any, to begin with. I mean, did you? S I have. S I end up like drowning in resources even on the hardcore. Okay, now I can see what I'm shooting at. If Leon will target the right thing. I can't target its weak spot because Leon keeps aiming back at the other thing. What are you made of? God damn. Oh my god, now you're here. Oh my god, dude. I need to bring more shotgun ammo. I really thought the ammo that I brought with me would be enough. Maybe if I brought a grenade. Shit, bro. I prefer to bring a grenade then. Bring more shotgun ammo. Uh, missing Claire's spark shot already. Leon's weapons are just so much worse than Claire's. It, uh, the only thing Leon has going for him weapon-wise is uh, his uh, starting handgun is uh, a lot more forgiving at the very early game, and then he has the Magnum. So he has Leon has a better early game and a better late late game, and Claire is just easier in every other regard. Did I get poison from that? No. Oh, fuck off! Not even- Okay, I have to- I have to kill this one. I can't focus on the other one. I can't do them both at the same time.
probably... No, I can't go back to where... Uh, I can't go back to where I can be on the ledge in front of that one, I don't think. I have to go this way. Alright, you got my full attention, boy, big boy. What are you even doing over here? Oh my god, that got him crispy. That got him deep fried. What are you doing? Wait, what? Oh my god, I didn't even know you could do that. Fuck off! My god, don't do that, then I can't see what I'm shooting at. God, these, these camera angles are not good for fighting these guys. This guy need the modder needs to improve on this on the camera angles here. Shooting the wrong area because I can't see what part I'm supposed to be shooting at. It did not seem like the grenade did any damage to it either. Camera angles were fine for fighting them in the, uh, the hell room area, but, uh, not in this, not in this place. It'd be really good if the mutter could, uh, had the ability to script camera, ang camera angles, depending on what's going on. So you could actually always be able to see their weak point. This guy reminds me a lot of- they remind me a lot of a Dark Souls enemy. They're a lot of the- like the pus of men. Auto- also the auto-aiming is just not working for me. Here, it keeps trying to aim back on it. The main part of him. There we go. Yes, these are good angles. Called this game Charlie's Angles. Oh, why are you so close to me? Stop making me stumble. <laughs> You're so annoying. Where do you go? Why are you here now? Finally, good fucking lord. That was way more of a hassle than it should have been. Now I gotta do this song and dance with this loser.
I don't have any more hanging ammo to spend shooting these guys. Is walk, walk backwards, Leon. Lean backwards. Where did it go? Hello? Why are you all the way back here again? I really do not want to spend the resources to kill both of you. Why are you facing that direction now, Leon? Holy shit! I am so sick of, like, Leon turning in a random direction. Stop it! Good lord. This part is really, really rough with the fixed camera angles. It would be fine if there were only one, but because there's two, and there's so many different angles that you have to fight them, and because it's an enemy that you have to target a weak point at, that's just a recipe for disaster in this mod. And because, like, keep Leon the quick turn is, like, really glitchy in the, the mod. Still needs a lot of work. Really? Really? Thank you. Like, he needs to disable the quick turn doing this bullshit all the time. Like, I should not... never... I don't know why this is still in the game. Like, why I'm turning on a dime like this with just a control stick. That's, like, so problematic. I think I've done everything I can in the control settings to do. disable anything like that, too. Oh, hello. Is there zombies here? No. Yeah, I'm using tank controls. Mm. Hold circle to run. Only run while holding circle. That's... I've nev I don't have to hold anything to be able to run. Why is that an option if I've not... If it doesn't actually change anything? You cannot run or pivot backwards or sideways. Well, that I am definitely able to. I am pivoting all over the place, and it's getting me fucked over so much, so many times. How am I even activating that? Seems like it happens less with this control option, but then I can't actually quick turn in a way that makes sense. Yeah, the, the controls still need some work.
Try not to die. Generally try not to do that. Need to grab the Rook plug. Whoa, fastest elevator in the world. Holy shit. What is the scope even going to do on the lightning hawk, I wonder? I guess this uh the mod still has like focus aiming even if you enable the laser sight option, so Mr. X gonna be in here? I don't think he will. Keep doing that. I already got that, Cody. I'm playing the second scenario, so I was able to get that early. Let's see, is there going to be another liquor in here, or are we good? Oh, there is! When does that guy spawn in? Does he only spawn in on in the second scenario on this visit? It's fucked up. It's scary. Where do you get the Rebecca photo in this mod, by the way? I forget. Oh my god, he's going crazy out there. What does this do? Lightning fast aiming? What does that mean? I assume it does something like increase critical hit rate or something, or increases the rate at which it, uh, the reticle focuses. Man, it's a bloodbath in here. Who did this? Who is responsible?
my little zombie pets still in here? Hello? Where are my boys? Where are my legless boys? Oh. Oh, a new one came in. That's not good. I'm glad I never came back in here. Oh, and you're here now, too. What is that guy even doing? Get a job. All right, everybody say goodbye to the RPD. Can I still not interact with this? No, I missed my chance. Do do Alright. Time to head back. I'm finna head out. Should probably wait until I have another large gunpowder to combine that with. <gasps> oh, 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 oh! I can use the diamond key now. <laughs> It's gonna take me forever to get back to that part, but um, I'm gonna I'm gonna curse myself if I don't use up the diamond key. Let's go on an adventure. Where's my new buddy? Oh, there you are. I thought you went out. I thought you uh crashed the door open. What's up, guys? What up, my guys? There's not gonna be anything else down here, right? There's still gonna be the dogs in the basement, I think. Puppies! What's up? Is a zombie in here? Yep, there's that zombie. Yes, use the diamond key. Get it out of my inventory. Forever. All that for a better. I'm not even picking up that film. Living on the wild side. Now for real. Goodbye, RPD. That's the RPD 100% cleared. Oh no, wait. I left a green herb up there. Oh shit. Well, might as well in the interest of being thorough. Will not rest until this entire map is made blue. Ruby of blue. Zombies! I'm back! Why is the entire world blue? What did you do? Disappointment. All right, the green herb has been secured. Tactical retreat.
We could just live here, to be honest. There's just like, what? A couple zombies still around and a liquor? Could make the liquor a pet. It's pretty chill here. What are you doing? Stop it. <clears throat> Hello, Raiko. Hey, I was able I was able to get a full heal out of that. It wasn't even a waste of time. Um, all right. Let me reload the shotgun. I keep needing to sneeze, but it keeps escaping from me. Wow, Leon, I wish you reloaded the shotgun that fast in RE4. <laughs> Where are we headed next? I need to unlock one of the T-Valve doors. <laughs> so I can get that out of my inventory as well. There's Magnum Ammo there. Almost missed it because I would have missed it if I didn't see the Shimmer Shine. Thank you, Shimmer Shine. Woo! How many elevators are there in this game? Like, if we were to count, there's Chief Iron's office, there's one, there's one we went to before, two, and there's this one, that's three. There's the lab elevator, that's four. There's the elevator in the sewers, that's five. There's the elevator in Ada section, that's. Six. Is the elevator that Claire and Sherry fall down? Seven. Oh, wait, actually, don't go this way. Charging up. Leon's charging up his final move. Oh yeah, there's another elevator in the lab as well. At the end of uh, Claire and Sherry's escape sequence, that's eight. Okay, they're just zombies down here for Leon, so... Unlike the G adults for Claire. I swear if you're able to double lunge while walking in water, that is unfair, I tell you. There we go. Now I don't have to run through the other G adult bitches. Okay, now for the hell room. Let's go. Probably gonna get the magnum out for this.
Okay, I probably will want to bring um, a shotgun with me. I will need the knife or frag. Let's get the magnum. Get another heal. Yeah, I need to keep some magnum ammo with me. If I had another large gunpowder, I'd bring the BP-70 with me. Well, actually, I should bring the handgun with me to deal with the, um, the G Young. Forgo bringing the magnet ammo with me. That might be a bit of a risk, though. Don't let me forget to attach this, too. That is overkill if I've ever seen it, and I love it. Let's see. Do I have any more shotgun ammo? Let's go. Okay, hopefully this will go well. Also funny Leon says that considering how many we've seen so far. Doesn't put us in a good position ammo wise. Might have to pick up the magnum ammo that is uh, over here. Just, let me just slip right on past you. No harm, no foul. Whee! Let's go. Uh oh. Let's deal with you. Really? Why is my shotgun failing at getting headshots? There we go. I would like to kill you, though. Leon, hit the weak spot! Thank you. The bullet's kept getting stuck on the main part of its body. Alright, that was not good. Uh, I don't like how much ammo I had to spend there.
Oh well, I haven't used a single high power gunpowder anyway. We're gonna have plenty of magnum ammo for the late game. Hopefully I can headshot the zombie without any shenanigans happening. Get over here, big boy. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I need you to stop talking, Leon, just in general. Get up. Stop talking shit. There we go. King plug. Whoa, who are you? Is this guy always here in the second scenario or the first scenario? Oh, thank God. <laughs> that would have been bad if I did not get that good uh, headshot. This handgun has been very good to me. I could have always just grabbed the flamethrower, though. <laughs> Why is the quick turn so glitchy in this mod? That's like the only part of the controls that still need refining, I think. It's just the quick turn is like glitchy. Bye. Think we should be smooth sailing. I think the other one won't be in my way, but we'll see. Although there is one zombie that comes back to life on the uh, platform thing, so I need to be careful of him. I know that much in the from the second scenario. Oh no, you need to get out of my way. Move! I don't have the ammo for you. There we go. Nope, wrong thing to target, Leon. Yeah, there we go. Nice, that went well. As well as I could have. Now we can save my waifu. Came out of that with like almost no ammo to spare. Well, I have the flamethrower. Second scenario is definitely way more challenging than the first, which is why I enjoy it more. Okay, where is my rook plug? 
Rook plug. There you are. I like how this puzzle is different on the B scenario as well. That's very appreciated. It's also harder. The Rook's next to the Knight, but not facing the Queen. The Knight ate where the marker says. Gotcha. Pick that up. And I need to pick up the Bishop plug as, uh, as well again. Rook is next to the knight, but not facing the queen. So that mean, that's just a roundabout way of saying the uh, um, the uh, the rook and queen are on the same wall, or the rook and queen are not aligned with each other. Not sure which actually. I think it means they're on the same wall. So the knight and the king are both on the, uh, are both on the end. And the only place the knight can go is here, then. Oh, wait, no, because the knight has to be facing the king. So it would be... King would be here, and, uh, wait, no, knight would be here, and the king would be on the other side. Yeah, it's showing someone 90, 1998 this game. This is what games will look like in 2019, literally. Right, so the king can't be next to the queen, so the only place the queen can go then, with uh, it and the rook being on the same wall, is over here. Assuming they have to go on the same wall. And then the bishop goes into the place that's left. No? Okay, so the... Shut up, Leon. So the queen and rook don't necessarily have to go on the same wall then, is what I'm getting from that. They just have to not be across from each other. There we go. There's a bit of ambiguity in the... what facing means. Almost there, Ada. Okay, I don't even know. I guess I'll have. I have to use the. Uh, I have to use the uh, the Magnum here because I really don't have uh, many other options for getting him uh, all stunned. Definitely get my flashes here. This is the single best boss to use the flashes at. Actually, I have a fuck ton of frags. I'm gonna use that to weaken, weaken him. Okay, this should be enough. Thank you for the ink ribbon that I already used. Cheese the hell out of this. Make some nacho supreme out of this. It's gonna be so cheesy. Jesus Christ. What the? They can actually aim at that. Is there any point to shooting at him? There isn't in the original. Where's this theme used originally? Where's this where's this music used in the original game? Hey there, 
there, Willy? He's been lifting weights since we last saw him. What's up? Oh, that did not hit me. Oh, it actually didn't hit me. Why did I get stumbled then? RE Games, can you please chill? Why? Why is I'm not getting hit, but I'm getting stumbled? Oh no, that's not where I need you to fall. Fuck. I went too hard on you, Willy. I'm sorry. Ugh. God, I hate this boss. Just like mandatory damage after mandatory damage. Whoa, that gave me iframes. <laughs> oh, God. The sub items really need auto aiming. Yeah, thank you, Leon. Oh, come on, dude. You should have gotten staggered from that. The grenades did decent damage to him. Am I gonna die if I get hit again? Might as well use my flashes here. There's not many other good places in the game to use them. Let's do this. Why is everything that comes out of Leon's mouth in this game <laughs> like make me cringe? If discuss it, how many resources I'm using for this? Let's hope that's the last of them. A little bit of a detour. That's not a green herb. Just relax, okay? So, what do we do now? Get yourself out of here. While you still can. I'm not just gonna leave you. Not like this. You don't understand. The situation's worse than I thought. You're not getting rid of me that easy. Protected me. Now it's my turn. I didn't realize we were keeping score. Grab my shoulder. Get your medicine, Leon. Push it, Ruth. Don't just leave it on the ground. Just trying to help. Watch your step. You want to help? We have to get to the nest. Nest? Umbrella's lab, right beneath us. Net let it slip. That's where the virus samples are. You up for this? 
I think I could fit it in my schedule. Come on. We got work to do. Yes, ma'am. At least I don't have to deal with the uh, random 2D Cable controls. Like when I was carrying Sherry. Nice. Where'd you get that? I borrowed it. Anyway, we're almost there. Can't catch me. Keep up, Ada. Bit of advice, try using knives next time. Grab this now that that guy's despawned. Let me carry you. <laughs> Let me carry you, he says, as he's on the other side of the room zooming. Oh man, this fits, uh, this works well for both of us because we're both like, uh, Leon's holding his stomach as well. Sliding backward. How fast is this thing moving? You know what I was thinking? I can't wait for the FBI to raid Umbrella headquarters and take those bastards to justice. I agree, but to be clear, you and your cop fantasies. This is a federal case. Once we get the G virus, I'm back on my own. Hey, Leon. Trust me. Trust me? Honestly, if I didn't, you'd probably be dead. Right. I, I thought I might need your help, and I was right. If you can secure the G-Virus, I can make sure what happened in Raccoon City never happens again. Yeah. You say it yourself. It's a federal case. I Leon, don't have the authority. Look at me. I'm a liability now. If I'm going to finish this case, you're the last hope I've got. I'm not just gonna leave you here. What if you're attacked? What if you need help? I'll be fine. How do you think they use it? Uh, I think it's in lore they crush it up into. I gotta see this. Thing. Into a. They crush the green herb up into a, What is it called? Like particles or dust or whatever. Into fine. Fine particles and then uh, rub it over the. Apply it to a bandage and then. A, Put it over the wound in the same way you would with the uh, disinfectant. Much time. You're gonna need this. Okay. I'll use this to remember you by. He's like. Leon. Counting on you. I know. Why is there an item box here? Also, what happens if you come out of that cutscene without <laughs> space in your inventory? For your safety, Never thought of that. Leon, stop zooming! Someone let him out. Thought there was large gunpowder in here. Oh, uh, there's a large gunpowder in the kitchen. Load these into the shotgun.
think the enemy layout here is the same as uh, the first scenario. Uh oh. That's okay, there's another knife right here. Was I supposed to come around here? Yeah, because there's ammo here. Can you fuck off? I just stabbed you with the defensive item and you're doing this shit. Oh my god. No, thank you. This is not the correct way to go about that room. I have to go around the table. I have to go the long way around, otherwise I'm gonna run right into that guy. Grab that, and then grab this. There we go. That's the right way to do that. Except for me, I'm not on the menu. Where's the other knife? I hate how the enemy layouts here are all the same. Well, mostly. There's like very minor differences. Hello? What are you doing? Get in here. Okay, this is your new home. Thank you, Dr. Lee. Might come in handy. Haha, <laughs> in handy. Get it. Whoops, I didn't mean to open that. You stay in there. Don't open this one either. You'd think those zombies would be uh, in the lunchroom would be holding the, uh, the bracelets that allow them to open and get access through doors like their employees, aren't they? Okay, it's hangin' ammo time. Oof, that is a big chunk of hangin' ammo. Do I have any spare greens that I can use to get myself back into fine? Yep. Let's go. Oh yeah, you get this early, so you don't have to come back here later. Glad for that. Did he just spawn in? Where are you? Hey, you just spawned in. He spawns in when you take that. OSS.
I just get a hit pouch out of this. And that's the last inventory upgrade we'll get. Oh, oh! Wait, why was there an armored zombie in there? Where did he come from? Did he crawl through the kitchen window? Interesting. He doesn't seem to care about me, though. G-Virus, more like the Yee-Virus. Yee-haw. I like that camera angle. And how it rotates. Just another day at the office. Okay, now I need to actually get the, um, the flamethrower out. Yikes. Jesus. What happened here? Someone got pounded. Oh, that's a good camera angle. That's an even better camera angle. All the camera angles in here are great. Oh, that reticle is interesting. Okay, I need to be careful because there is a, an ivy that will spawn in here at some point. Take me by surprise. Okay, the puzzle, the comp, the key code things here are uh, changed for this scenario. So I got a good look at it again. Either four or five. Okay, so what am I looking at here? Tetris colon F pause. Oh no. There we go. Uh, Tetris colon F. Pause. I think you find the trophy this time, like, in the, uh, freezer. In the hall before the freezer. Is there anything for me to pick up in here? Some large gunpowder. Herbicide synthesis. 
I want to synthesize the G virus vaccine, not some herbicide. What do I have to do to get the? Oh, yeah, I have to unlock it. I could just guesswork from those, the one, the, the hints that it does give me. That's feasible. Uh oh. Thank you. Don't think I... I'm gonna pick that up later, because I think I have all the handgun ammo that I'm gonna need for the rest of the game. I will come back and pick that up in a minute. Any liquors in here? I don't forget if the liquors spawn in the same way. No liquors in here yet. Okay. Gotta kill all the sa the zombies in the same way. The B scenarios are so half-hearted. Good god. Like half the stuff is randomite is like switched around in a good way. And then half of it's just the same. Knife both of you. Hello, this is your 10 a.m. wake up call for your chiropractor. With a house call. Haven't seen her in years. It's like we're gonna come down in the same way. Oh wait, I can access the save room over here. Go over to there. And then dump my items off. Go pick that the rest of the stuff up that I didn't get to grab. Think are all are, do I need to do any more uh I think I don't I don't need to do any more signal modulator stuff until the west wing. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna do a cheeky strat here. Since there's two liquors that come into this hallway, I'm gonna use the knife on one of them. And kill them with kill it with the knife. And then I'll use the flamethrower on the other one. Uh, if only we had super liquors. the other one come in. Oh, it comes in from up there. Does knifing alert them both? Oh, fuck you. You ruined it. You have to knife them from, like, behind. Oh, fuck off. Can you get stunned, please?
The knife does so do so much damage to them, though. It is a bit tad tricky, though. You have to be, like, behind them. Why are you already aggroed? There we go. That's what I like to see. Woo! Can you get stunned, please, bitch? What? Why is he not staggering? I guess the flamethrower is just not good at that. I'll knife you too, don't tempt me. Oh, other way, Leon. Other way. We really need auto aim for the freaking sub weapons. Crimson head or liquor? Liquor, definitely. Crimson heads are like almost discount liquors. I wonder if the crimson heads are like a the phase before they turn into liquors. I have a present for you. Why the fuck are you getting aggro? Bro, these, I don't understand what they're doing. I'm just lob a grenade at them for misbehaving. Knocked him right off the ceiling. Die, both of you! Oh, I almost got it. It would be awesome if I could group them both together and then knife, sli knife slice them both at the same time. I don't actually want to try that. I think I was like in a good, in a almost in a good position to be able to do that. Why are you aggroed, motherfucker? That's gonna hurt. the liquor. It's like a petting zoo. That did a fuck ton of damage to him, actually. <laughs> That's so good. Love it. Just as viable in fixed camera. Alright, I got this stupid thing. Alright, we got Tetris, I, question mark, and colon. Welcome back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. This lady's just still gonna be asleep. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? <laughs> I don't, I'm not able to do anything here yet. I don't know why I came in here. I'm a bit of an idiot sometimes, you see. 
I was running in and out of here the whole time because I mugged up the sequence of events in Claire first. <clears throat> hey, Toa. Stream's not delayed, by the way. I was just took a weirdly long time to acknowledge you were here. Sup, dude? Slicey, slice, slice. Slicey and it goes the dicey. There's a plant in here somewhere. Hello. I can do this. This is some gorgeous fire effects. I'm not done with you yet. Damn it. Damn it. Now he's a spicy pepper. Shit. And goodbye. Ah! <laughs> that was very rude. I'll have you know. What the? What the? That's number six. You can have it. You can take it. That knife was well spent. Very well used. Alright, after this, I don't think I'll ever need to use the hand again ever again. Hello. Oh my gosh. At least let me use up the rest of my handgun ammo. I am never using that. <laughs> That's a shame. Every 45 caliber round they're going to give me from here on out is just not going to be used. <laughs> from now on, it's just shotgun, flamethrower, and magnum. No more zombies I need to kill. I still have this knife. Does the knife do good damage against Birkin 3, like it does with Birkin 1? I don't know the what the speedrun looks like for Birkin 3. I imagine because uh, he took so much damage from my acid rounds in uh, my Claire playthrough, I imagine he also probably takes quite a good chunk of damage from grenades as well. Because uh, on like G4, where you don't have to hit the weak point to actually do damage. Uh, from like non direct damage. There's still shotgun nail shells in here I haven't grabbed. Need to get that, uh, need to get the large gunpowder that's over there as well. Flamethrower ammo for both of you. I'm not gonna be using it against either of the bosses, I imagine. Okay, there's gonna be a surprise IV 
in here. There definitely was on one of my playthroughs. Maybe he burst in from the other door. All right, Tetris, I question mark, colon. This is like, this is actually really hard to memorize if you don't come up with those stupid naming schemes like I do. It's colon. There's the upside down question mark. now is this puzzle different yeah it is adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity hello again Sophie welcome 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 way too much. Yep, things are going good. <laughs> this version of the puzzle is a lot harder than the first one. Let's get that all the way up there. Oh yeah, that's full. Full of slime juice.
think this will solve it. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Um. I need that amount, and then I need to, like, do this. Yeah, I think I got it. I got it. Got this by the balls. Not a freeze dry this thing. Yeah. Cooling complete. I'm um, it's cool like me. This lady literally never bothers you if you don't bother her. How nice of her. That did the trick. Warning. You have dispersed a dangerous solution without authorization. That wasn't a dangerous solution. I am a dangerous solution. Shit! <laughs> I like how he's still missing his hat. Makes me feel validated for shooting it off of him earlier.
And off we go on our merry little way. Without getting to fight a moth boss. Tragic. I have to watch this. Last time I used the signal modulator. It is awesome, as an awesome sauce. Probably not going to use the flamethrower anymore. work I'm not handing over anything we have our orders dr. Birkin I'll ask you one more time Goddamn Jay Martinez. Way to ruin it. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the same. Let's move. So those were G samples. Those are all these papers on the wall. Didn't notice that before. Lots of things you don't notice until you play this mod. There's a grenade over there. What is a bioreactor? No, not the wetness. <coughs> All right, time to make the most magnum ammo you've ever seen. I wonder if I should, how much shotgun ammo I should make. I have a lot of large gunpowders. How much do I have? this much 
How many large gunpowders do I have? I have two. I have three. I can afford to make some handgun ammo if I need to. Let's make some magnum ammo first and then see what I got left over. And saving literally all of my yellow gunpowders throughout the entire game. Looks like I'm gonna have one left over. Oh, I have two. I have enough to make two stacks of magnum ammo. Um, depends on how much I want to use the handgun. Yeah, I'll probably use the handgun. Probably still use that. Um, might find another... I don't know. I think I'll find a... I actually pick up another large gunpowder in the arena, but I don't feel like looking for it. Use up my shotgun ammo first, and then I'll switch over to the handgun. Use all that up, and then I'll uh, save... Uh, I'll have enough magnum ammo then for uh, uh, Mr. X Tyrant boss fight. Take the frag grenades. I actually, want to actually probably use up all the frag grenades in this boss fight. Seems like uh, the indirect damage is good against them. There should be another first aid spray in the arena. So many knives. Okay. <laughs> Let me save one more time. I'll definitely get another ink ribbon before the tyrant boss fight. Oops, I need to write. I need to take the G sample. That's what we're here for, after all. <laughs> I still don't know what she got injured from. What the hell's going on? Sorry, William. Like she's injured in both Claire first and Leon second, and I don't know why. Like it's almost as if the plan was to have her only show up injured for one of the cutscenes, but they like never actually got that far, so she's just injured for some reason and like all four versions. Your umbrella too. You're telling me you weren't involved in this. Yes. 
But we never meant for this to happen. Then tell me everything. Right from the start. I would love to hear about your childhood, Annette. But we never intended this. Spin it any way you want. You're still responsible. WWE time. that grenade go? That went into another galaxy. Can you stun, please? There we go. Very selective stuns this guy has. you showing your big point now? This is not going well. I need to find that other first aid spray. close enough to shoot any of his weak points. Bullshit! I literally got sucked back into that attack. Okay, no, this is not going well. Shotgun is horrible for this. Also, because of how, like, the camera's so zoomed out here, it's hard to see what I'm doing. Wait, I didn't even bring the magnum with me. Oops. This is a bit of a faux pas. Oh god, this fucking wristband, dude. Can I just toss that, please? No, I need it. I need it to... Wait, no. Ada activates that. Do I need it to get out of here? Can I just toss this? Oh, for fuck's sake. I, got to, I forgot to take the G sample again. God damn it. All right. Now back to Ada. Now back to the wife. Self-destruct sequence will begin when lockdown is 
You know, nice and crispy. I need to take out his uh, back reef point. Oh wait, I already did. Hey, Fox Essence. Yeah, it's a really good mod. He's already really weak because of all those grenades. Uh, I hate how impossible it is to dodge these attacks, dude. the other first aid spray. Whoa, he's spinning to one. Well, they're not impossible to dodge. They're just like really RNG heavy, I guess. Where are you going? Whoa. Oh, baby. Okay, that was a good dodge. Oh, st oh stop it. Stop doing that. Just die, please. Turn around. Uh, you are overdue to die. Thank you. Oof, my ammo count is not looking super for uh, Mr. X. Yeah, the modder really knows what he's doing when it comes to the, the framing of uh, shots. Although this mod does overuse like super wide angles like this. Although I kind of understand for this boss, but maybe you could uh, zoom them in a little bit for a couple of these angles. Okay, got some more Magnum ammo. The bosses hold up surprisingly well with the, this mod. Not even gonna interested in picking up those anymore. Jesus, that looks bad. It feels worse. Believe me. Talk about what you said. Much I believe. Just tell me he'll destroy that G sample. No, it's evidence. It's going to the FBI. <laughs> you trust that? Bitch. Thank you, Fox. What's that supposed to mean? She's not FBI. She's a murderer. 
mercenary. She's going to sell it. The G-Virus is going to go to the highest bidder. Bullshit. I hope you're right. But if the G-Virus gets into the wrong hands... As opposed to in your husband's hands? Has a great angle on Leon. Ah, oh, much better. I wonder if I'm gonna get more shotgun shells. I have some here. Might as well take this out since I have the ammo for it. It's more powerful. Yeah, I love Resident Evil. Made several videos on the, the remakes. I was just thinking about you. That makes two of us. I was getting worried. You know, we make a good team. I gotta ask you something. Way's clear. Please, tell me you got it. Oh, I got it. Can we verify the G-Sample when we get the hell out of here? Before we do that, I ran into Annette. She claims you're not FBI. Why couldn't you just hand over the sample? As I realized, as much as I wanted to trust you, I didn't. I really hoped it wouldn't end up like this. So that's all this was? I was just some pawn to you? Look, I'm just doing my job. And I'm doing mine, so drop that damn gun! I'm taking you in. Hand over the sample. Taking her into where, dumbass? The RPD? Yeah, feed her to the one liquor we left alive. And you shoot me. But I don't think you can. Please tell me there's some explanation for how Ada survives this. They just like completely gloss over that. Also, how the G-sample survived as well, that's supposed to... She's supposed to still have that, too. Wesker kind of needs that G-sample to be able to, like, make his Ouroboros his all-powerful super virus. Leon, don't you start doing that again. <laughs> no, stop it. Stream froze? Still going good for me. Just tune out your sorrows with the sound of heavy metal, Leon.
will take this first aid spray. They need it. Yeah, who is that? That's not... Because it's no one I know. Hmm. Oh, no. It's the Netflix... It's the Netflix yeah. actress. But the whole place is coming down. Listen to me. You need to get out. Fast. Yeah. There's a way out. We can make it. Where are you now? Claire. Are you still there? Leon? Hey, Leon, you're breaking up. That is not Claire, that is Clore. Claire's evil twin. Another knife? Why do I need so many knives? I don't. Do I still run through a whole bunch of IVs in here as Leon? I'm gonna pack this just in case. I didn't want to use that. I don't, you don't. You don't get to have my grenade. You get to have my knife at best. Using the flamethrower on these guys is actually worse because I could just instantly stun them with the handgun. Chlorine. Yeah. Her name could be Blair as well. No, nope. wrong target, Leon. Wrong target! Oh, my God. Knife. Well, where is this guy going now? Wait, what? Wait, did I not shoot one of the boils? Whoa. Oh, can barely see the door there. Ah, is this a fucking joke? Oh. 
Oof, I'm so sick of the quick turn glitching out. Also, this smokestack sucks. I can't see through it. Use your flash grenade. Oh yeah, you get to get to see the uh, the, the proper way that uh, he should look when he's uh, in his final form. That's so much less cool than him getting, Mr. X getting, uh, falling into, uh, molten metal and then coming out in his final form. Here, he just, like, it's so much more lame for him to just get ambiguously exploded a couple of times. Is there a typewriter here? No. Aw, they, they don't put a typewriter here? Get rid of this friggin' band. I'm sick of having it in my inventory. Oh, making his wrestler entrance. There we go. Instead of just looking kind of fat without a shirt, he is actually looking like a one-winged angel. Come on. I ain't use up that. He's like a fighting game character. Woohoo! Dodging like one, too. Baby, let's go. Still not as fast as in the OG. Yeah, let's put him on fire even more. That'll help. <laughs> what was that throw? Excuse me? Ada, any second now. Any minute now, Ada. Ada? Any minute now. Whoa, that, <laughs> that, that fire whip. Thank you. Would like an explanation as to how she survived Where did this thing come? like that's that's also one of the reasons why the redesign of the lab is so dumb that it makes it even it, it like hurts it like 
You you can't see anyone surviving that, not even Ada. When it's like the size of the Death Star. And there we go. Kind of thick though, not gonna lie. Woo! I'm gonna save this. Make some zombie bacon. Five minutes until detonation. Shit. Last train out of town. Gotta get out of here. I put that away. Where did you get that? I put that in the item box. I can't believe I actually miss her. Like I said, we would. This is this. This is, this is Sherry. These scenes are so horrible compared to the original. Oh, Jesus. I mean, the oh, entire God. ending sequence, to be honest, is like I'll ten go. times worse than the original, in like just about every way. really hope the modder uh, fixes uh, the quick turning bugginess. Why would you even give me a knife at this point? Like, what am I going to do with that against D5? Oh, that's not a good camera angle. It's uh, thick over here. None of the damage you do here actually matters until the uh, eye shows up. I guess I shot the rocket launcher too early. I can't see from this camera angle if he's ready to be killed or not. That's like, that's not like a very good camera angle. It should probably be moved back a bit. If it's to make it feel more claustrophobic. My spinning tactics will intimidate him. Want more bullets? Be my guest. Come on! Want 
some more? I didn't pick up, take out my uh, handgun this time. There we go. Uh, this whole ending cutscene is like so much more lame than the original. There's uh, so much less cool stuff going on. Sherry, Sherry doesn't get to do anything to help this time. Like, uh, why would you remove her, her role from this scene and helping stop the train? And this is the worst cutscene in the entire game. I, this, is, this ending is so bad. Like, the dialogue here is so dumb. Leon doesn't care about bringing down Umbrella. Claire doesn't care about finding Chris. Nope. Let's just result. Let's just treat this like a sitcom. Who cares? He might be able to give us a ride. What if it's not just the city? Get Cherry out of here. At least the characters look good. What was Leon's? plan there like what uh, why why were they suspicious of a truck driver <laughs> i don't understand what is going on in this ending so is it over yep we can get married we can adopt sherry we can get a parrot we can teach her to play piano whatever it takes yeah you damn right we will also we'll somehow stop a zombie apocalypse we'll be fine it's like this cut this ending cutscene Feels like the ending to a game, a completely different game, hey, to a, a, a story that we didn't just finish. <laughs> we can get a puppy. A puppy. And a parrot. God, so stupid. God, this is like such a, like it, the it, the bad thing about an ending like this is it leaves you with like a sour impression of the game. It leaves a bad, lasting impression. Is the worst thing an ending like this can do. Holy shit. Yeah, I can't in good faith say this is a good remake, all in all considered. It has its genius moments, but it's just overall not a good remake. <laughs> uh, those genius moments do make the the part, the overwhelming majority of it, that's like not a good remake. Or sting even more, because there's like glimpses of genius there. But then you look at the rest of it, like that ending cutscene, and the, the whole ending sequence in general is just like, ugh, so disappointing. Ugh. Anyway, this mod is incredible, though, and it gives us a peek into what could have been and uh, the remake that uh, I wanted and a lot of us wanted. So, yeah, I hope this mod keep, keeps getting updated and keeps getting improved. Needs to improve on the quick turning uh, to, um, to fix the bugginess there where... F uh, Flicking the analog stick around will fling your character around and quick turn them, which uh, should not do that. A um, couple of the cameras need some adjusting. Uh, the like, Some like in the the uh, sewer section with those 2G adults comes to mind. Uh, which is kind of, it's That's probably really hard to balance though with 2G adults that can be facing either direction. Without the ability to like script camera context, sub context sensitive cameras. But uh, yeah, this mod is still 100% like playable though and it's like a really this is a really great way to experience the game honestly and uh, has some um, a lot of it in it that i'd like to see 
that show us what uh, the the next uh, step for th this uh, gameplay style. It uh, elevates some things in a lot of ways, like having the ability to enable a crosshair, though, to uh, uh, dynamically target different parts of uh, the bodies. I like that a lot. A whole bunch of customization, the following the semi-fixed camera option, which is even better than just fixed, in my opinion. But yeah, this mod was incredible. So I will bid you guys good night for tonight, and we will uh, close the story on this remake once again. And uh, hopefully any future remakes they make from this will, uh, will they'll uh, keep improving on uh, and uh, learn from the mistakes they made from this remake. They already did with our RE4 remake, but hopefully our Code Veronica will be even better. So yeah, good night everyone. Next, uh, I'm going to start on my next video, which is the uh, a design uh, design. Uh, diary sort of series going into the design of Halo 2 Rebalance. So first episode of that is going to be worked on tomorrow, and I hope to release that on a monthly basis, uh, if not even uh, more frequently than that. So yeah, I will be very busy in the coming days. So yeah, good night, everyone. And uh, back to Halo 2 Rebalance we go.